Thomas. Hey gamers, it's us, Deeks and Young Money, in Adelaide for Big Cheese. We're about to watch Top 8 Melee, starting with Samus and Fox. Zai, Nangs. PR 4 or 5, I believe. 4 or 5? Yeah, I think Who's uh, 3? Is it Pizer, Grand Daddy? Uh, Musket. S A Oh, okay. I believe it's four. Um, first thing's I. Victorian Fox, aggressive move, exciting. Very funny. Yeah. Fun to watch Fox. But, uh, upsetting MJ, Microsoft J. Yeah. To make it in. Jordy got them six Johns though, so. So, yeah, he, he's not looking very well. Um, but on the other hand, I think I think Ruben's gonna take this. You think Ruben? I take think this? Ruben being nice. We're friends with Ruben, so we can we can yeah, call we him. Yeah, we Jack and Jack and Ruben. But, uh, yeah, I, Zai doesn't have the Ready? Samus match up. Uh, yeah. He's played Cody a few times, Noxus a few times. Uh, never beaten him. And by most people, Ruben is the better. Samus. Better than Cody. Better than Cody. I mean, he's a lot more like Samus than Cody. Yeah. Straight into it. A few knockdown dash attacks from uh, Ruben. Big Rube. Dice and Nangs. High percent though. Oh. Nice scoop. Really, really nice scoop. confirm. A good scoop. Nice scoop. <laughs> oh, that missile hit you in the face. Back here. The Rubens, yeah, Rubens is going to try and consolidate this stock a little bit. And he doesn't want this. This is the dangerous part, is when Fox starts putting on the damage to Samus, it starts getting there. Yeah. Samus can bring it back relatively easy, though, with just recovery call routes with yeah. missiles and stuff. Nice down smash game off stage, close the edge down. He hits him square in the schnozza <laughs> with the, uh, the missile. missile. That was a good um, good read, good follow up. Yeah, it's very strong. Zai loves that. Zai loves getting in your face. He knows he's got invincibility. He's gonna go for you. Get that big punny. Ruben just kind of feeling out the waters right now and, and getting the spacing all correct and fishing for a down smash or a crash cancel. Big, big uh, combo there, double downer to a tech chase. I bet. Oh, 80%. I like that. As a Fox main, I love that. That is a quick one. Oh, no. Yeah, that's it. And he'll take that. That's three stuff. We got a tournament, guys. <laughs> and, uh, don't, don't worry about what uh, young boy, young boy's eyes are sipping on. Powerade, Powerade in a can. Some fairy, some fairy potion. Oh. Very surprising first game, in all honesty. I was not, not thinking uh, Zai would be coming out this quick and this yeah, hard. Yeah, just kind of ran away with it. He's getting those early kills. Ruben has to really uh, consolidate his stocks a lot more. And, and 150 plus stocks. That's what you're aiming for, Samus. He has to get more into Zai's head. To make him think more about what he's approaching with. Do you know with uh, when, when with Crab, can what can Fox do? Can Fox like chain an up air or, or two? Or? Sometimes you can get an up air, but I think 
it's harder to get than like with a moth or something. Because Samus can nair out of it, double jump out of it. Yeah. And then it's kind of hard to follow her when she comes down because she can use bombs to just like dip either way. Found good pick for Samus. The top takes a while for her to die off. She can get some weird big cheese. <laughs> on the smoothest stage. A large fromage. A large fromage. Zai's playing this very confidently. Yeah, yeah. He's getting those early kills yeah. and he's still oh, not sure about that double jump. <laughs> neutral. And that's it. See you later, Zai. Sometimes that just happens. Um, sometimes it really do be like that. Samus hits like a truck. <laughs> Ruben just not not optimizing that punish. Before. Something that's uh, really defining about Ruben is how much he likes to grab, especially the neutral. Mm, yeah. yeah. Uh, he, he opens up with with grab a lot, and he doesn't rely on that crash cancel down smash. Yeah, I definitely noticed that playing him yesterday. Yeah, you have to play him. Yeah. yeah. You play a lot of Samus's, they like to down smash, so you like shield a lot more. Yeah. And then, because Ruben's grabbing, you shield because you think the down smash is coming. And he just wins the mix off. Nice up smash out of shield by Zai, just confirming that. Silly dash attack. These dash attacks have, yeah. Why, why is he dash attacking so, so heavily? Who knows? Yeah. Some sloppy. Uh, Maybe it's something in the water. <laughs> something in the water. The unfiltered Adelaide water. <laughs> 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 So Zai's, Zai's movement is getting a little bit sloppy. He's starting to clean it up a bit now. And he died because pretty much his ledge movement was, was off. But yeah. <clears throat> Grab if he can clean this up without taking too much damage, it'll be pretty good. If he can get here, that would be a massive game, unfortunately. <laughs> It'd be massive again, Samus is at 90%. <laughs> Yoink. Hey, nice dog. <laughs> if you lost it. How's the weather down there? <laughs> He's getting very early kills. He's 120 below that. Uh, you'd be happy with killing a Samus. Yeah, you gotta find that up smash. That's the good thing about Fox in this matchup is the up smash minimalizes how much damage you have to put on. Yeah. Whereas with like Falco, it's a lot harder. You have to get it down there somewhere or throw out a forward smash. Back air, kill at like 150. That's rough. Big thing is, Ruben's giving him up op openings. He's throwing dash attacks on shield. He's throwing out silly down smashes. Mm. Ruben's really got to time it all up a bit. Like, I know, use your forward tilts, use your down tilts. To make a bit of space between them. Because Zai's yeah. eyes coming in quite willy nilly. Yeah. You want to really threaten like the area you're holding. That was a really good wave dash out shield by Ruben. Finishing off this this edge guard. Oh, yeah. So I should have gone to ledge there. Yeah, Ruben yeah. gave up the ledge straight on. You can react to that as well. Ruben, did, Ruben gave it up very early. Yeah. Just uh, oh, these are two handsome, handsome four eyes. <laughs> There's eight eyes on the screen. How crazy is that? What the it's like I, playing doubles or something. Uh, Ruben having the donut tag as well. Interesting choice of tag. Oh, the shy guy blocking the missile. Ruben going for a big combo here. Gets reversed by uh, missing his grab. I don't know if I like Yoshi's as a counter pick oh. against Samus. I think, yeah, if you're killing at 92, you're very happy with it. Yeah, I'm just a s scared of Samus getting his, the big cheeses off the side. Yeah. You just died to down smash. Like that, or forward smash. Just Ru like Ruben keeps on giving up ledge, like what happened in last stock. Uh, yeah, last stock as well. He just wave dash back or move, moved to cover the central options yeah, earlier yeah. than what he needed to. Oh. He crash canceled that get up attack, but he, all he did was just run at him. Oh, nice crash cancels by Ruben. Finish with the back air. The double, the double jab on his crouch cancel mixed up. Missile to neutral B is what you have to do. Just bait out that jump out of shield. Nice dash attack. Those are the dash attacks you need to have, and then connect with them and, and put them off stage. Hmm. Okay, Ruben doing the trademark grab. 
Oh, nice little crank there. Oh, that's oh, so close. So close to getting a little gimpy gimp. Oh, nice, nice. Ruben probably should not have jabbed there. I think he was thinking of forward tilting. If Ruben can take minimal damage here, he's got a pretty good lead. Especially staying in crash cancel for some. Oh. Yeah, Zainese. Uh, he's moving. He's moving, but he's not like he's not grooving. He's not controlling it. He, it's not. It's not in his terms at the moment. Ruben. Ruben gets to to put the terms and conditions in. Yeah, yeah. That's a better better forward to play. Once again, he just keeps keeps on going center stage. So I really need to like realize that he's giving up uh, edge really quick. Yeah. And he's contesting Zayn going center stage with those. Especially when you're down. It's like you might as well take the easy 100% I'm getting back alive. Cheeky Firefox here, can't convert. Samus are too high of a percent for up throws. And, and I think Firefox the shy guy actually messed him up. Because he hit both Samus and the shy guy. Uh, so they didn't like the animation. Either. Nice up smash from Zayn. Brings it to the last stock edge. Never mind. And he's out of here. Later. See ya, punk. How's the weather <laughs> on the right? How's the weather over there? <laughs> so where do you reckon? Um, Dreamland? No, I reckon Zai would see the stadium or he'd run it back. Oh, it's size pick. Oh, yeah. I thought, yeah, Ruben would take Yeah, it. if Nangs had won, he'd be Dreamland easy. So this is a big, this is a massive pick because... Ruben gets missiles. He can yeah, he yeah. can play the missile game. And now, although uh, Zai also gets low ceiling, earlier kills. Lots of space to catch. run away from weird. There's lots of space to interact with Samus where it might not go as well. So where on Yoshi's, if you mess up center stage, you're like off stage. Here, you're just on the edge. Has nice bombs to change out the descent and uh, coming off. Yeah. Nice spot dodge. He's just reading these shield grabs. That was a big read, yeah. Zai is so good at that shield pressure and then imagine like wave dashing away or like baiting out that grab and then finishing him for it. He's just really cognizant of what people might pick if people if they get different pressure to apply, apply to their shield. That was a really good recovery from Zai, just realizing that like I can go all the way down because I know Ruben's not, not like respecting the wave drops at the moment. Mm -hmm. Rock transformation. If they play out the rock transformation super aggressive, this could go either of two ways. There's just so much damage to attack on. Yeah. And Fox can kill Samus really easy off the top of the rock. We gonna pit fight? Oh, goes in the pit. See you later, mate. <laughs> Dude, I think Zai's definitely like looking for the shine of the um, of the neutral bear. Nang's looking for the neutral bear. Yeah, he's trying to get that even stock count. <laughs> Winning stock count. The size of game it, dude. Just sit and shine. <laughs> Ruthless. So, yeah, yeah Ru Ru Ruben going for the guaranteed throw, throw to charge shot. Yeah, he's got to go high, gets up tilt. Nope. Yeah, Zai Zai bringing back the neutral game. Coming back. Nice. He knows. He's got the reads. I wonder if Nangs will adapt. Or if, I don't know if he'll even need to, if he can keep this winning up. That's the big thing as well. If It depends on percent of things throwing out these grabs. If he's doing a sub AD, it's fine. He's just going to cop 20%. And in the, the wider things, like if he gets that grab, he's going to get 60%. So it's 20 or 60, take or give. Yeah, yeah. Oh, nice. I think Zai is just trying to push to take this too hard right now. Yeah, Zai stay in this shield, getting back that center stage. Ruben getting really aggressive with his down air approaches and wanting to take control of the air where Samus isn't really good. Here comes Zai. Nice, good, good firm. Catch. Really good. Ruben's last stop, uh, coming down with a couple of missiles, throwing around in there. 
Ruben really trying to you control that air once again. Protect the wind. <laughs> Nice forward to get him off stairs, can you confirm? Windmill, Windmill open him. Open him. Down there, Shine. Oh, nice. So oh. I got stuck on the platform. Up there. Zai's playing this really clean. Nice, nice. Very nice. Zai popping off at that one. Little slap, slap on your little leg, Zai. Now we're going to do Oh, those are some, those are some cool legs. He has some big, he has some free trunk thighs. thighs. Dreamland, the classic. Size, no more early kills, pretty much. Yeah. Size gonna have to go. He could gimp with Shine. It's really hard, but he have to work really hard for everything else. Yeah. If yeah, Samus is good at getting out of combos, you gotta win neutral just that many times. And it's just all guessing games that can go so wrong for you so quickly. Something that was evident in the Kai, Kai and uh, Dice Nang's game was that um, <laughs> it threw me off the Twitter tag. Yeah, with, with uh, Kai and Kai and uh, Ruben's game earlier. In Yoshi's and Battlefield, Ruben was taking that like initiative and pushing it to him. Whereas in Dreamland, it was a lot more on the ground, a lot more. You have to come hit me. I'm yeah, gonna yeah. like survive. No matter what you do, I'm just gonna be a pest. So if he tries to adapt that playstyle to this again, I think that's gonna be detrimental to him because his eyes are sick boy has seen with that uh, that mad ledge guard. That was very custom. Nice nice platform movement from Zai. Just move weaving in and out from him. It was good he didn't go down. I would have gone down, I would have died for that. Oof. Brandy for Brandy up smashes getting thrown out. Even if they connect, like what are you gonna do? You're gonna have to try and juggle Samus when he's up there. When she's up there. Hey man, you know, it's 2018. 2018. She can be whoever she wants to be. <laughs> nice wave dash back reacting to that roll. Big charge shot, grab blades, roll up. This is exactly what you don't want as Fox Hunter. You want to stay grounded as much as you can and then kind of tempt the Samus in her space. Make it feel uh, less comfortable with her like, tilt setup and walling. And you want to like, overshoot your stuff. Yeah, this is game five. Size tournament stock right now. Oh, not gonna get given now, but 26%, 35, loading up the percents now for things. Ty's gonna play this so well to keep up. Oofed. Needs to hit this. Ah, uh, he's throwing it away. Uh, should have fallen to his down, down smash there, but still. He's putting up a crucial percent because how, how's Zai going to take three stocks now? Yeah. Everything Nangs is getting now is just money. Oh, yeah. Nangs knows. He's just throwing out throwing out moves. He's saying, I'm gonna, if I throw out 20 moves, you get hit by two and I'm still going to kill you. Nice raid on the full up and then finishes it. Nang's very happy with himself. Zai not very happy with himself. The first game of top eight. Mm. Zai out seventh. SA, early blood on Victoria. Which I think is going to be the story of this, this top eight as well. You think so? Lots of Victoria SA matches. It's going to be that rivalry, I mean. It's not going to all be the SA, dude. Who we got next? We got Kalen Muscat. It'll be Kalen and Muscat, the other losers game. Flamingo boy. El Flamingo. Sturdy mo. Disgusting shorts. <laughs> Pink socks. He looks very interesting walking down the street with him. Yeah, I think going out tonight is going to be a... Um, I'm going to hope. Those hope shorts are a bit high cut, to be honest. Yeah, something might slip out. See, if his, you, uh, see his pasty thighs. Something might slip <laughs> out. <laughs> Choosing the Hoktag, I imagine. Home. Home. 
home ear. That's wow. what it is. Are you, yeah? yeah. For you? Because you're his homie? Yes. Yes. See. See, Senor El Flamingo. Mm -hmm. Oh, watch out. Okay. He's a monster. Watch out. Mascot drinking monster. He's a monster. The game is fuel. <clears throat> I've never seen Musket lose after having a sip of monster. Dangerous. How many times have you watched Musket? Every time. He's played on stream. Okay. Most. You have like a Twitch notification or something. Yeah, Musket is not taking the sticks. So this is interesting because um, they played in pools. They did. And they were both not very happy with how they played. It was a close game three, five. Uh, Musket's recovery was very predictable. Kalen, I think he has did a few times as, as he sometimes does. But the main thing was Musket won. And if, if Musket's winning and, and he's playing predictable, he's got like that other tier that he's gonna go to during now, I think. It'll be interesting to see how they come back and study from yesterday. Yeah, I wonder how seriously they took yesterday as well, if they just write it off as just pulls, just a pools match. I still made it out pools, don't really care. Don't have to think too hard. Yeah. <clears throat> the classic Fox Ditto. Kalen's gonna straight up ban FD. <clears throat> Doesn't like FD. Kalen's not a chain grabber? He hates FD. I think Musket is a chain grabber as well. He is a chain grabber. Alright. Striking the Dreamland starts off. Back to trying to get an early game. Yeah, not sending that back throw too far at zero percent. Nice jab, changing up those diamonds already. Oh, getting caught in shine from the platform. Even Kaylin getting caught on shine when he's in out of the shield, shield pressure. Yeah, his movement's not looking too crispy right now. Yeah. When people are drilling from the ledge this early in the game, you know it's not looking too fresh. Yeah. Yeah, a few nerves so far, I think. I think they're moving they're moving around each other right oh, now. Nice forward. Uh, that was custom. That was sick. Who like cares that. if you died, dude? You just, you just popped him. Bop, bop. Him the schnoz. The schnoz. Oh, sad back yeah. Unfortunate. Can't, can't close out that edge guy. It would be difficult no matter. Oh, once again, Kevin's getting Ke Ke caught in shine a fair bit. I think the up smash clanked with it, so he couldn't. He got a wrong timing for his wave, wave dash out. Yeah, Mus Musket flopping his his pressure a little bit, getting caught with an up smash. Mm. Yeah, he gets to follow up. Let's see how much he can do. Uh, living just using every centimeter of the weather up there. Hey, how's the weather up there, Kalen? <laughs> Oh, cheeky arms attack by Kaelin. Kaelin getting, getting center control, but Musket doesn't mind dancing around a little bit. See if he can close off this edge guard. Gives him the edge back, and now Respects terrible to dash. dash. Good back there. Straight back there. Just a whack back there. Just hit him. A whack there. That's the good old, you just have to hit him. It's easy. Spot dodge, get get out of here. That was a good call out, knowing that um Muscat's just trying to get that grab. Yeah. Yeah, see if Muscat Muscat's punish game is very centric around that grab and starting up with that. That's like the opening that he's prime time. As I think Kaylin's happy to like have a few straight hits and like I'll try and scrap it around a bit. I don't really have any Oh Kaylin. <laughs> Not like these. Nice knockdown. Gets, gets the knockdown. Can't, can't follow up with anything too serious. Yeah. It looks Once. like Kalen's really trying to push it. He's not reaction tech chasing so much. He's, there's a lot of things he's really looking for the miss tech so he can just keep following up. See. Where it's good to just sometimes get take your two hit, <clears throat> let him pick an option and then react to it. Nice by Kalen. Closing out that edge. That was huge. 
Double back air. Reve Fishing and reverse back air. Do you know how cool that is? <laughs> Star? She's the other side. Not the other way. This is crazy. Yeah. M2 straight to Chef D. As you say. Where Moscow likes oh. to cook up the combos. Okay. That was nuts. Oh. Kalen very smart to do the push off and uh, knowing that Moscow was wearing a wave dash out of shield. <laughs> very, very smart. He's living. Oh. Just good, good follow up to get the up smash. The soft back air. Kelly get caught in shine still. Sometimes where he's not looking, not moving as clean as he would like to be. Mm. Here it comes. Ah, crap, crap. Well, Muska was warming up against Nick before Nick's fox. this. I'm not sure if it was against his fox, but he was playing. And Kalen was just sitting there. Just watching. Good pivot up smash. Um, the big thing with that is because uh, Musket and Nick, they play a lot with each other. Like, uh, Nick goes to Musket's place and, and vice versa. So I think it was a bit of like Musket warming up Nick for who he's going to come against. Who's like Don Yeah. True, he could do that. Which we'll see shortly. Here we go again, the chain grab. How, how high can he get it? 52. It goes oh. for a while. Nice jump. Kevin was it? Kevin was able to get able to get out, but just wasn't able to get back into neutral. Oh, yeah. this that's jab. unfortunate. Yeah. That's gone. This game's basically a write-off. Yeah, it looks like Kevin is uh, understands who's going to lose on FD. Mm. He knows he hates it. He's Great Muscat just great homie bait. stalking Kalen. Very smart bait, trying to get uh, Kalen to go all out. So that would have been really funny if Kalen just went down to edge guard and just died for it. See what I mean? He's just really antsy to try and hit him. Yeah. But that is okay. Kalen wants to be in your face and like and and be bob bobbing and waving in front of you. Yeah, but it's like he's. Oh, really bro. hoping he can just go bop, bop, bop instead of like hit him, see what he's going to do next. And then if he's shielding, grab him. If he's dashing, overshoot an aerial and him again. Both take a swig. One of Monster, one of the devil Blue Power Raid. Raid. Blue Power Raid. Kevin is zoning up Yoshi's. The Yoshi is absolute polar opposite to FT's Yoshi's. Oh, Musket is moving. He's very comfy with those platforms. Mm. He's just comfy with the dash dancing. Kevin okay, missing that shine, missing punishing that. Can he, can he get this edge guard? Racks up a few percent, can't finish it off. Up there, yeah. should kill. Nice. Nice. Alright. <laughs> wow. Okay, let's stuff him up again. Just kidding. He stole out the invincibility and hit him with that that Firefox. <laughs> now that that's melee. Now that's top ten epic gaming moments. <laughs> that is a top eight move. Shield drop, Shield drop back. back. Yeah. Uh, let's see if Kaelin can convert as much off uh, grab as, as Musket can. Full smash is trying to get him to the edge. Nice. Sends him back and forth playing ping pong with himself. <laughs> Once it tries to go the uh, stole out the invincibility, he will fire shots again. Doesn't work out the same. Musket adapts him very quickly. Double jab, up smash. Kaelin's still a stock ahead. 5% ahead too. 20, Up 38, 50. That could have been real bad for Musk. Yeah, that, that was the reverse. That was one shine. Yeah, and he was dead. Oh, lovely arms attack. Shine, push them to the ledge. Musk is really smart, just taking his time. Doesn't want to rush onto the center stage again. Let's see if we can clean this up. Oh, dash a jump off. Oh. Uh. The new thing the kids are doing these days is to cover that higher side B, you ledge dash on and just up smash. Or grab if they're low. Ledge dash onto stage or platform? 
On this stage. Yeah. I guess they side B just a little above the ledge, ledge dash on, and then sub smash. On. Just gotta be quick with that reaction. Yeah. Of course. Kalen getting a lot of knockdowns, which is promising. Side B back on, cheeses him a little bit. What would you expect of a cheese? <laughs> dash back. And then says, uh, how's it going, bop. man? See you later. What's the weather like up there? <laughs> <laughs> Let's see if Kalen can get money off this. Kalen dropping the edge guard. Mask again, that trademark grab. Doesn't get as much off as he normally would. Kalen getting bailed out with the platform. Kalen wants this game so bad. He needs this game. That shy guy oh. messing up Muscat. That up there probably, uh, maybe not. Might have killed. Dash attack. Oh, smash. Oh, oh, oh. Getting nervous now. Now they're throwing out the strong moves. They're both looking for that strong back air here. Kaelin, horrible roll in. Muscat was ready for that. Kaelin knows. Nice platform cancel. Can get to ledge? No. That's just really unfortunate. Should have slid off. Pop off. Should have slid off to ledge. Yeah. He was just. I think he was just trying to shield after, and he didn't notice. He just slipped off. But what's really, a man to do? Really do be like right? that. Ready. <laughs> <laughs> well, my brother. I think they're going back to Yoshi's. <laughs> Gotcha, man. Oh, uh, making me look like a tag tag. <laughs> oh, what? A tag tag. What does that mean? You, you put a tag on when you play a melee. You don't want to look like a tag tag. You play Sheik and you put a tag on, and then they know where you're going, so you're a tag tag. Tag tag. Tag tag. Oh, Musket's Peach coming on out. Beach. So, Musket beat Ruben round one playing Peach. And he's got it for his particular matchups and, and obviously also particular stages. He's definitely, he's probably second best Peach in Australia behind RJ, yeah? Or uh, no, maybe third behind Quetz. Yeah, well, it depends. I, mean, I think, um, no, I think, I think Musk is better than Quetz, but behind Quetz, damn it. <laughs> damn it. Musk <Musket> sucks. <laughs> Better, better luck next time, Musky. It's also RJ hasn't been playing too much either. I, I think he's going through a phase where he's kind of retired. Yeah. He's going through the emo retired phase. Yeah. Forwarded. Get off my stage. The See you later. Slap. Oh. It'd be a massive game if that, ch that turn connected. Mm. Kalen really hounding with his edge guards as well. Going off stage, getting in her face. I'm not sure why Kalen went to. Sound of dreams. I thought he was going to go back to Yoshi's, but... Uh, yeah, I would have thought that too. Yeah, Kevin's Ka just letting her recover as normal. Got to respect Peach as she's coming back. Like all women, you got to be respectful. Mm, very respectful. Yeah, Say your pleases and thank yous. <laughs> Please, thanks. Excuse me. God blesses. Mm. Amen. Amen. Yeah, okay, Kaylin kind of, I like how he's playing it. He's giving her space, but also slowly constricting that space. Yeah, he's, he's like, not running in. Mindlessly. He's definitely showing that he's trying to hold the space outside of Peach's direct range. But he's just sometimes tripping himself and gets clipped and then just catches like a quick 50 or a stop. Definitely not tripping when he's doing those up smashes as cleanly as that. Just walk up. Walk up, bop. See you later, go. <laughs> oh, double down here to shine. Could have been big if he had it connected to that other shine. I can't believe that down tilt didn't get hit by the down smash. That could have been a game changer for D. Oh, no. Kalen's not happy with this game. This is Kalen's final stock if he were to lose this game. Potential final loser stock. Nice, nice. Nice job up smash. Bring it down to last Kalen's stock. One inch. This invincibility. Straight Let's back see. to neutral. Musket not, not retaining that center stage too well. Full throw. 
Up throw, chain grab, go left. Trying to go through the platform. Change it. Great. That was really good by Musket to go into that platform and oh. keep it going. Unfortunately. Good stuff for Musket. Bad luck, Kalen. Kalen not happy with himself. Muscat yeah. still drinking his gamer juice. It's on for E. Kalen dressed. He was dressed for the part. He definitely was. El Flaming. Davox and Sora next. Davin and Josh. I think these guys have literally just been warming up for the last however long those two sets took. With each other? Or? Yeah, yeah. So this could be a pretty good game. Uh. Donkey oh. Kong. Wait. Oh, no, that was Davin doing that. I thought it was Josh, like, doing a little disrespectful. That was Davin doing Donkey Kong. Yeah. How do you know? Because he was moving his control. <laughs> I looked oh. over at the, the IRL. <laughs> yeah, so in doubles, uh, yes. Josh finished him with a clap with Donkey Kong in, in doubles finals. But yeah, Josh is a disrespectful dude like that. Oh, flash and shield. Very tense. Let's go. Josh has been complaining about his controller for the last while. Yeah. It's got really bad vertical and horizontal snapback. So sometimes he'll running shine, he'll just get turned around and the shine misses way back. Yeah, it's a difficult one this way. I think uh, Sora, obviously, in my opinion, is the best in the room. Yeah. Um, but, Sheik Fox, Davin just needs to get a few, few grabs and he can uh, do some special things with it. grabs and a few gimps. It goes both ways with the uh, shine grabs and whatnot. Yeah, yeah. Having walling him out, keeping him in the corner. Josh finding a way out, back to center. Pushing Davin into the corner. Oh, Davin not realizing he jumped into that, that dash attack. The big thing about this for Davin is he's going to have to really play around Sora and really be on his like game with throwing out moves and stuffing him to his, when he's approaching because Sora gets in those positions where you can't be solely reacting. Sometimes you have to be like, you're coming in now, I'm going to throw out a move. Little dash, dash dance, return around, short hop needle. Dab again, the knockdown, can't convert off it. Now it turns around. Josh grab, straight into edge guard. Sent him the wrong way. Still in the corner. Got through, grab. Dash attack. Good arms attack. Arms attack, big arms attack. He would have been off stage in a world of hurt. Wave shine, up smash. Off. How's the weather? <laughs> That's called the how's the weather combo. <laughs> Old reliable. Old reliable. Miss Davin missing his platform movement, giving him, a, giving Sora a free, free grab. All two off stage. Reverse fair. Oh, very, very, very clean. Two stocks each. Josh this is not looking very happy. Yeah, Josh, Josh is getting a little bit frustrated by how, how many times he's getting opened up. Not, ha not too pleased with how he's playing Lucio at the moment. Clip the shield. Very cheeky yeah, shield play, nice. and then uh, confirming it into a edge guard off stage with a shine. Let's see how much money Josh can make with this stock. How <laughs> much money? Fifty dollars, sixty-two dollars, oh. seventy-four, eighty-nine. He almost made a hundred bucks. He's gonna, he's gonna get more than hundred. He's gonna get a life. Cool. Nice. Cheeky. I think that one is. We were just playing friendlies. I'm better. And I understand what you're doing now. Damn. Just doesn't want to be there. I love uh, how much Josh like interacts outside of the game with the opponent yeah, as well. Yeah. Always finishes in and says, hey, 
You suck, by the way. <laughs> you ain't shit. Yeah, why'd you do that? You're an idiot. You're a big dummy. How's the weather up here? How's the weather next to me? <laughs> up tilt city. Just jumping out of that platform. Found the up tilt. <laughs> oh, good estimate. Turn around. around. Oh, Joshy. Did he just give it away? Yes. He did. He did. <laughs> Indeed. And then Davin homie stocks him. Yeah, nice homie stock from Davin. Showing Playing a three stock bent. game. <laughs> what is this, bro? <laughs> <laughs> nice game. <laughs> Uh, Josh once again getting those knockdowns, getting those openings, and all he has to do is he's getting consistent 50s, consistent 40s. Grab ledge, nice. Oh, can't connect with the shine to wave shine up smash. Up there, nice, clean up. Finish him off, getting a whole one stock deficit. Big for Davin not to take too much percent on this one. Trading with the down smash. Nice slide off to get ledge there. Could have been a big combo or a gimp. Shine, wave shine grabs. Finishes it off with a pretty pretty standard edge guard. Everything Josh gets with these next two socks is just makes it easier for him to finish this one off. It's massive. It doesn't look like Josh has made too many adaptions. It's just been a lot of micro things that he's cleaned up on. And then also... Uh, not like that though. Getting hit by forward tilt, you're gonna, you know what's coming up next. The big shit, a hundred plus. Slap a Rooney. Unfortunate that grab was on the platform. Can't, can't benefit too much from the tech chase. Oh, Josh getting the goddamn needles out of here. Step, stepping on some bricks, man. Oh, cheeky down there at legs. That was very, very smart. And cheeky roll read from the ledge. Davin just being a little bit lazy and putting from ledge to back to neutral and just give, gives up his stock quite quite freely. Mm. Where's he Sora playing a new character? Uh, I don't like seeing Sora play math and stuff. Yeah. Kind of disrespect for him to the edge. Straight back into a final, <laughs> not final game maybe, game game three. Davox is wanting this winner side. Because once again to lose the side, we've seen we've seen competitors in there. It's a Wide deep losing side. Kind of thick if you think about it. Very thick. At least two C's thick. Josh just baiting out movement from Shiro. Mm. I haven't seen Davin do too many um, nares out of shield. Whether Josh is on that level to punish it, he's just been punished for the past few games or like off stream games or. Yeah, yeah. Cheeky back air or uh, stuffed up his needle because he wanted to, to land and auto cancel that and then into a grab. Unfortunately, landing before he can, he gets punished accordingly. Two, two, two. Down for us, holding down. Up there. Oh, Davin getting a little bit sloppy. Hitting these tech flops. Oh. Not, nice up there, though. Yeah. Hey, made sure he didn't get back off stage. Realized Sora was on top of him. Yeah, it would have worked really well if Sora hadn't thrown out a hitbox. A little bit sloppy from Sora then. I think he uh, missed his grab in for it or was expecting a swat dodge maybe. So this is big. How, how is Davin going to be opening up neutral? Davin's got the punish game, but does he just have that, that neutral openings that he can get? He's going to have to just win neutral and kill him three times in a row. Which is not looking likely. Weird angle that that down, down to the center. Cheeky up to, up air, and then Sora going ham. Custom edge guard. How that center? Sora, Sora's losing that off smash. Yep. Nice, nice. And that's video game. Good cleanup. Complete. 3 0. But.
Another beast goes into the loser's bracket, being another beast. Davin. Dabox is... It's just unfortunate because that's how the tiers are working at the moment is like you have two or three obvious players in that top category with Sora being a little bit above them, maybe. Yeah. At this, at this tournament in particular. Maybe not even a little bit, but a bit. A bit above. A little bit above. You can close that gap with mental game stuff though. You can close it with a few ledge dashes here and there. Mm. A few back throw gimps. Mm. So Nick obviously showing him the uh, beautiful sights that Adelaide has to offer outside. He's pointing out some funny things out there. And he's pointing out churches. Churches? Yeah. Oh yeah, because Vic is, uh, Nick is a, um, is a very active Mormon in the Mormon community. <laughs> he's a good representative of it. Mm -hmm. It's really interesting that he's here on Sunday because normally they don't go out on Sunday. They actually stay home. Oh, really? Yeah. I'm not sure how he would have gotten here either because they don't, they're not allowed to drive. Mormons? Yeah. Well, Mormons, I think. I'm pretty sure it's Mormons. The Mormons the ones... Oh, no, I don't want to be racist, to be honest. Uh, yeah, back to the match. These friend, these warm-ups are looking pretty good. Mm. Very active. Both dancing around each other for a bit. I think... I believe they're waiting for the stream. Yeah. Kai's, I think, covering up the sun, glaring through. Oh, uh, okay. That's what he was pointing out. There was no, he was still was pointing at churches. Sun. Kai just got up to fix the sun. Kai just wanted to check it himself. Yeah, it was glaring in Kai's eyes. He couldn't see the stream chat properly. He wants to make sure no one's dropping hot R's and slurs and stuff. Nick just being a nice guy saying, don't worry about it, brother. Yeah, we You're got this. Good. Kai running and now changing the overlay. Nice. nice. Great work by Kai. PB by Kai from door to stream. What was that? 2.3 seconds? Maybe even less, man. Oh, big forward smash. So these guys have played a lot over the past three or four days. I think Miles was staying at Nick's house Thursday night. Yeah, he was. Yep. <laughs> Neither of these guys going out last night. My, oh, huge down there. That early kill on Fox. Don't even worry about your punish game when you can do that. Yeah, just... Wah. I don't need a combo, you idiot. You're dumb. You do that there. <laughs> now I am killing you. How's the weather down there? <laughs> it's the big interesting thing, I think, when... Um, these guys play, they've played each other a lot, like in friendlies and whatnot. Yeah. So now you see the things that they've been kind of having in their back pocket and not really wanting to show the other. Yeah, yeah. And Nick's really good at that as well. He can make a competitive game and then also have all these little tricks and TI mix-ups that he keeps for the tournament matches. Mm. Whereas Don plays with his heart on the sleeve, I think in friendlies and in, um, and in tournament. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I've been hanging out with Josh and Miles, and they've been talking about all the little things Nick does in different situations, trying to get, like, put him in those situations and then catch him doing the habits he has. Yeah. And I haven't really seen... I don't think Miles has had much chance to put Nick in those habits, in situations for him to use those habits, where he can really get anything from it yet. It's just been Nick has been on just the whole time. Really, really big if you get four stocked in your first game. So, Donnie yeah. looking for that. And yeah, I think that's it. Yeah, well, that's Moth, knows. really. Oh. Moth can just give it to the spaces. <laughs> Was that Coca Cola you saw? I have no idea. If Donnie's drinking a Coke, I'm worried. I think Donnie needs to switch back to green and red fox. Yeah, he's made the vanilla stuff. I don't like it. I miss the VB Fox. So Don just has to pretty much not play like he played just then. And yeah, not yeah. be giving, giving away these openings. Like, go away like what he's done. Yeah. When you have that corner pressure, try and capitalize, but don't, don't overdo it like what he's done here. He definitely just bombed in there into the corner. Yeah, he needs to, he needs to calm down a bit. Donnie knows he can win this. Not when he's doing that thing. There's no reason to fight Mars there. Really clean by Nick though there. Just 
covering covering all the options and yeah. like forcing uh, Don B's recovery low. He oh, may be sad so all the way down weird. to the point he didn't have to hit him again. And now I wonder if Miles can just SD. He's looking over it. Oh. Nick knowing that forward smash is gonna send him nowhere. Tries to get a, a fair combo. Doesn't work out. Oh, trying to get the tricky DI. It was so fast. Nick is moving. He's moving and grooving. Alright. Oh, he no. did. Too early. Way too early. He's doing better than the last game. <laughs> by, by a one stone. Hey. It, one is infinitely better than zero. Don B is not looking like Don B should be. Yeah. And Nick is, like, to Nick's credit, he's playing clean and capitalizing on every little mistake that, that Don's been making. Yeah. I feel like Miles is definitely forcing his mistakes on Nick. Don, Don's speeding up. He's picking it up. All the boys popping off for Donnie. Don, once again, just, yeah, playing neutral now. He's not, he's not running in like an idiot, he's, he's, yeah. he's flirting. He's not bombing those nares again. Shine out a shield, can't convert off anything. Nick opening up with a talent shield and then forward throw. <laughs> when Marth grabs you on the edge there, it's all just a huge DI mix up. Like if you DI out to get out of the up throw down air, you cop a forward throw F smash. <clears throat> I think so. what's best is to no DI. What's massive now is Nick has two FD picks. Yes. So Don, if he can win this one, has to win on FD twice. Given that Nick wants to play that. And to be honest, Nick, Nick's been playing so well off, off just straight hits and like confirming off grabs without chain grabbing. So. Yeah, it could make it a oh. big difference. Ridiculous deal on that shine. It just looks silly. Yeah, getting a bit greedy with that side B. Nick was, Nick was prepared for that. Yeah, the instant side B is usually pretty lazy. At, at that height, I think Nick, Nick knows. Yeah, and it's easy to cover the landing too, because you can't go anywhere after you use it, you just go down. So Miles trying to use the slides EI to, to change Nick up, but uh, Nick too good to at realizing when when it is slides EI and when it's just vanilla. And yeah. Nick basically evening it up. That's what Nick's been doing a lot today as well. Light shielding on platform. Shield, shielding on platform, getting ready for a um, shield drop, aerial, and like waiting out invincibility. Very, it's really smart, yeah. Here we go, let's see if we can. Miles able to get out of moves, just mashing. Up throw, up there. Nice, there. nice. Hidden only Single hit, so he gave him no chance to SDI. That's what we like to see. That is optimal. Miles looking completely different from game one. Yeah. And, uh, oh. Hi. Oh. Nick missed timing that forward smash. Can't can't follow up from the grab onto the platform. Cleaning up some more percent. Miles oh, Randall. Randall helping to hone me out. Let's see if Nick can clean this up soon. Randall again. <laughs> Doesn't matter. Cleans it up either way. So I'm interested to see if Nick starts changing up that invincibility uh, and what he does on platform. Just shield drop, Missed shield drop the trick. Missed the shield perk right there. If he shield perked that up with up air, it could have been big. Big percent. Let's see if he can get this without getting grabbed. Yeah, Tony, Tony really putting the pressure on now. Just nice. can't, can't let him breathe. That was a huge good last stop from Donny. He is drinking a cola. He's drinking a cola. A nice crispy Coca-Cola. One dollar. Uh, Big G's brought to you by our sponsors are Coca-Cola. And Coopers. And Coopers. 
And as what we were saying earlier, they have deep picks. Let's see if uh, Miles going to outplay in neutral, not get grabbed. Try and get those shine openings, and the shine opening can, can lead to a big damage. Nice. Or not quick enough on that up smash to try and get him in after the uh, cooldown. Up throw. Here this we go. This is where he missed. Here we go again. So it looks like Don's just trying to mash out. He's not too worried about the DI. He just wants to mash out. Yeah. And lazy Don missing that tech. Actually, that could have been a tech, tech change up. Mm. See if Donnie can clean this stock up without taking too much damage, though. It'll be super important for him to even get close to winning this game for me. Here it comes. Hey, up Danny. throw, boys. Up throw, gang. Up, up. Good swat at the ledge. Yeah, Miles still playing very patient and neutral. Not, not over committing yet, but once you get down two stocks, kind of worried and you kind of feel that pressure where you have to go and do something. You throw your, throw your like, uh, fundamentals out the window. He's getting really antsy trying to kill Nick here. Good tech by Nick. Nick, very good. Up air, secure. Doesn't matter though, because Donny took no percent from that. May as well not have done it. He did. Yeah. Pretty much. Up this would have been different weather from where he went. <laughs> Don once again playing the neutral. He's not, he's not rushing in too much. Yeah. Power shields to get up attack. Continues the combo. Up at, Oh, misses the up tilt. Up throw, up tilt. Fair. Yeah. Good DI. Up throw. How's he going to finish it? Just like that. Actually nuts. That was sick. It's pretty cool. I think Don was thinking he's going to do an up air. Maybe, maybe. Once again, yeah, it's, it's a sad day for Donnie, I think. That's uh, difficult to beat a marathon on 49% and you're 60 plus. That's cool. Bad luck, Don. Yeah, Don definitely not overly happy with his performance. Throwing game one quite convincingly yeah. and game two. Ooh. We got PCG and Dom Hines coming up to give you the next however many matches they're doing. It would be losers quarters, losers semis, losers mm. finals, winners oh. finals, however grand many. finals. Six. No, man. Nice. So, right. Davin and Ruben coming up, commentating. We, we gotta fucking PCG. wrap this up. We're not commentating yeah, another one. I know, I'm saying PCG and Dom's coming on. Yeah, but we gotta do this quick. Later. Well, Kai's gonna ban us.
Welcome back to the Big Cheese from Adelaide, South Australia. We are no longer Deeks and Young Lane. We swapped them out. They've been kicked off. We've outclouded them. Definitely booted them hard. <laughs> Get That's clouded. Privilege. <laughs> <laughs> uh, now we've we got, just saw uh, Nick, is one of the favourites for the tournament, is locked in his place in winners' finals against yep. Sora, probably the other favourite. So yeah, absolutely. Yeah, things are going to plan. That'll be an exciting winners' finals. But now we've got two losers quarters matches coming up. Okay. We've got Adelaide. We've got a South Australian match. Mm. We've got Nangs and Davox. Nangs on the Samus and Davox on Sheik. Of course they haven't stage struck already. How inconsiderate the worst. of them. Like, just go to like, Battlefield. When people are waiting for the stream and they just hand warming and then it's just like, alright guys, we're ready to go. And they're like, alright, cool, time to strike. They're like, what were we doing for like several minutes? Not agreeing to Battlefield either. They Apparently. struck Battlefield. They're going to FOD. Okay. They should have just gone to Battlefield. I guess they both want to be on FOD. Yeah. They both like it. It's maybe one matchup. Like, Samus's recovery is already pretty vulnerable to Sheik, and not having wall to use for extra options. Well, I guess Nang's not a fan of that. Anyway, but makes it hard. This is notoriously an awful matchup for Samus, but. Sort of the modern idea is that maybe she can do some stuff. She's got a, she da has a little bit more going on than maybe people saw it. Yeah. Oh, like, look oh at that needle. My God. Yeah, oh my needles God. are pretty deadly. And grab. For oh Sheik. my. That was beautiful. Sheik gets follow ups off down throw, and Jeez. a lot of Samus's game is crouch cancel and shield, and grab beats both of those. So okay. Samus has a hard time. Yeah, it feels like it would be an awkward matchup, at best. Mm. Ooh, okay, but two er relatively early kills. Keeping it close. Oh my god. Oh, <laughs> so fast! He, he's really coming at him. Oh, look at the moving. Like throwing out a lot of moves so far. <laughs> It's a matchup that you could see being a little bit more patient, a little bit more measured, but these guys are just coming in with the bap bap. Ooh, let's go NTSC. NTSC. It's funny because even though both these guys are SA, like Adelaide, Davox studies in Canberra, so they probably haven't played quite as much as you might think. Okay. Yeah, I think if Nangs can keep himself grounded. Uh, Davox wants to keep jumping and throwing out moves. Like wave dash back, yeah. just crouch cancel. Could be pretty effective. Just do the stuff. Okay. These guys are going pretty close. Still very much anyone's game. Why? You don't need to do that in this matchup. You can just grab. Just get him. Get your hands on that Samus. <laughs> Holding down is so good. It is really good. I feel like Davox is just giving him a lot of respect and maybe the character, like, he can just shut down a lot of those options. Mm. And, like, he's really fast. And some, especially, like, if you're expecting a slow-paced match, you're like, oh, Sheik Samus, you know, he's, it's going to be moving around a bit, a bit and, like, he's going to try and edge guard me and I've got to watch out for this, 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 and this. And all of a sudden, it's just fair, 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 fair. And you're like, whoa, <laughs> hey. wasn't what I was thinking about. You'd expect the pace to slow down as they sort of both settle in and they start to, to like, oh yeah, that's where this character's options are and the hitboxes are here and oh, he's crouch cancelling that now. I better chill yeah. out. But every now and then, the pace picks up. Mm. Ooh, that grab. It's <laughs> a brave man. <laughs> He's just playing around. Oh! I think he's starting to feel a little bit confident. Oops. Holding away. They were going pretty back and forth. Like, 
Like, there were even stocks, but it was also, like, very much, like, tit for tat. Like, these guys were keeping up with each other. But it, it seemed like at the end, he just figured a couple things out and just ran away with it. Yeah. I really took control, like, started hitting Davox away and, like, wasn't giving him easy openings. He didn't get fed, like, five times in a row any yeah, of that, that, that yeah. last stock. <laughs> That'll probably help, actually. It's so counterproductive. It's a nice little mix-up, doing an empty hop into doing a grab. Ooh. Did he charge that down smash just a little bit? <laughs> no sweet spot. I'm not sure that Samus can really cover if she like sweet spots with a double jumper or up B. Like, it seems like yeah, it's one of those things with Samus like has to be extremely precise and probably actually can't cover everything at once. Samus kind of wants to stay on the stage in most situations because Sheik's invulnerable, so you can't do like a rising nair very effectively like you would see against yeah. Fox and Falco and other like characters. Mars even. Yeah. Can't run off like double jump. Yeah. 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 I mean, you might like stand up down smash, but if you DI down smash well, you go super high, so you have lots of recovery options. Yeah, yeah. Davox probably wants to like take his time recovering. Force Nangs to keep hitting him over and over again rather than giving doing like rising forward airs and things like that that risk just having his stock deleted. Ooh, a little bit of platform movement, Trixies. That was an amazing uh, <laughs> No sweet maybe spot. I feel like maybe he had a better option than that. But like grab into forward air maybe, or like and maybe hoping that he messes up the DI and you get an up air even. Mm. Or maybe at the ledge like that, he could DI Ooh. away. And that was really that was nice. I like that a lot. That looks definitely. He knows he needs to use the needles. He's missed a few times, but. Nangs is getting off the ground, like he ended up up on the platforms and he's giving Davox a real chance to open up his like shield drop game and everything. That's part of why Battlefield's good, because he can kind of go to the platform, threaten with needles, and then yeah. shield drop. He's got a lot of options for playing around Samus' toolkit. Hmm, good air dodge. Ooh. What is that grab? Man. Foot extended into the grab range. <laughs> Samus never dies. Samus lives forever. Ooh. A little baby suit there. Got him to... There go. Oh, he missed! But Whoa. Because that is one thing Sam's can do to counter down throw forward air. If they're not quite perfect, you can do an up B and use the invulnerability oh, and yeah. you can catch Sheik out. But that just gets you out, that doesn't get you anything. Oh, like, 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 that just keeps you alive. Yeah. That's not a reversal. And sometimes even if you hit, like, you can miss or, or like you can that. trade or, yeah. yeah. Or they, um, like Sheik doesn't get sent far enough. Oh, oh no. no. That's, a, that's a little chance for oh, okay. Nangs. Super wave dash. You don't mind? Just for fun between stocks. He really is moving. Oh no. Chain. Ooh, that was. And he's got a full charge. Oh my god, he goes for it. I guess without his double jump, that charge shot might have killed him. That was going somewhere. Shield drops right into a fair. He's got oh. one chance. And the needle's missed. Oh. Okay, no Those needles. The needles. <sighs> Thought you were recovering, but no. <sighs> what are we... Hmm. Like, do you think maybe Stadium or FD? Samus normally hates FD, but it really takes maybe away a lot of... Like Sheik's platform yeah. options. Shield drops, the ability yeah. to just generally be tricky. Mm. Yeah, so at this point, it can be like a bit of a zoning game. 
And now if she wants to like jump to do needles, she doesn't have anywhere safe to land and she's gotta come back to the ground. Yep. Oh, that's not worth it. What are you even gonna get if you back air a Samus at like 80%? <laughs> Where's she going? Risk reward, Davox. <laughs> I mean, you just want that safe space, right? But that's, that's yeah. exactly what Nangs was looking for. Oh, that's not nice. I think this would be a pretty big upset if Nangs was able to clutch it out. It would be, right? Yeah, Davin, what, like the fourth seed of the tournament? Ooh, I think Nangs was seated second in his pool, so that means he's like below the... He like he's not even seated top eight. Which, yeah. Uh, who seated this tournament? Why is Nangs not seated top eight? <laughs> he's like... He's smashing it. He's guaranteed at least fifth place so far. And yeah. Maybe seating's hard. Seating is really hard. <laughs> it's... Seating good is at least like achievable, but seating in such a way that no one yells at you is literally impossible. Yeah. Okay, well, this, like, this is what he needs to do is just like wall him out and keep him off stage. But there you go, you miss one thing, Samus is back. And in the middle, and large and in charge in the middle of the stage. You haven't got any platforms or anything to run around and like make space for yourself with. No. Just standing there holding down, saying, What are you gonna do? Nice jab. Okay. Able to only take 20 <laughs> percent. Is Sheik's crouch cancel percent valuable in this matchup, do you think? I haven't, it doesn't look like Davox has done too bit. much with crouch cancel, but yeah. I could see it being used to great effect. But I feel like at that percentage range, Samus is just going to be using more projectiles and more baiting as opposed to trying to like run in with an F tilt. See the extended needle like hitbox. <laughs> Kick the needles. I think that up tilt would have missed if the needles weren't there. Maybe, maybe. Oh, gets oh. some burn. Oh. And goes for it. That is so rough. It's like ambitious. The needles up. again. Well, that was a really smart up B. Ooh. Like gained a little bit of extra height just before the needle hit. Oh! <laughs> he got him! Tapped into his gamer encyclopedia there. He <laughs> knew about that situation. Like, oh, this DI? All right. Charge <laughs> shot. Bah! Ooh, sweet spots. Okay. Doing hack stashing, hack -stashing with Samus? Samus? I guess that's a thing now. Who thinks of that? You probably don't even die if you stuff it up, though. That's the worst. Because you're so floating edge very slowly. Deep breath, shrug of the shoulders, <laughs> trying to stay <laughs> stay loose. I rate it. It's really intense, like posture is important. Yeah, being able to keep your composure is really important, and sometimes part of losing your comp oh no oh no. Trying to come at him with the NTSC. Whoa! Great power shield. Can he edge guard though? Oh! The over 100 get up. We might die. The needles. Yeah. The needles. And yeah, no, uh, no tether. And he's got him. This is so good against Samus. All right. So if not FD or uh, FOD. Maybe Stadium, like he can use the platforms for missiles. No, okay. Oh, I guess he'll just survive until 200. Except if again, like you see... But he's been he getting gimped. He's, yeah. he's not like that. Like that's the problem. It's not the blast zones. No. As soon as you drop below the stage, those needles kill you. They, they have been straight up murdering you. Like... I guess he's hoping that he'll uh, hit amazing DI and be super high every time when he goes off stage. Fair dodge. Flea players tend to have very good DI. <laughs> as is the, as su such is the legend. They just don't ever have to DI for combos, so they just survival DI every hit. <laughs> 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 
Ooh, catches a wave dash back out of shields with a grab. That's uh. Oh, rough. So effective. <laughs> the downside of this counter pick is <laughs> went nowhere. <laughs> oh, he might die. Needles are so good. Alright. <laughs> Had to die eventually. I think if he died better, he may not have died. <laughs> it was insane. Oh man. I really like that runaway down air. It's very like um reverse Falcon Stomp. I like to chase someone, like to, to get someone coming after you. Wait, Samus down air, right? Like pop them yeah. up. Yeah. yeah. Samus is down air is a pretty big hitbox actually. It's, it's definitely like a <laughs> Got around the needles, but <laughs> we get to the ledge. Now Fox is just looking stronger and stronger as the set goes on. He's definitely been adjusting. Oh. Back to the stage somehow. It's like, I don't know what Samus is meant to do to get. Oh, great that was text. Great. <laughs> it slides yeah. off so far. That's definitely the like 2018 Australian is do some crazy, insane recovery tech, but then still get edge hogged or up smash when it's one second later. <laughs> Davox is not giving Nangs any juicy openings. It seems really hard for Samus to match Sheik's punish game. He's living. Especially when it's just down throw forward. Yeah, yeah, and then look for a needle ledge guard. Samus maybe gets Nair or back air, but never at kill percents, really. Ooh, got him. Ooh. He's hungry. He really, he really wants it. <laughs> He's just coming after him, just throwing out the legs, throwing out the hand. Hold down, Nangs. <laughs> Crouch. That's what he does. That's what your character does. Like okay. Lift it up. Hold. Ooh, really that was good. good. That was that. That's the coverage. It's risky because we've seen Davox tech some, uh, tech some, but it paid what? off that time. <laughs> What? Oh. oh! Okay. He tricks him, falls through the platform, does it again, and gets slapped for his troubles. Oh, oh my god! He knew. He knew. He knew too well. He like, <laughs> did it early. Jesus. I don't want to roll with Samus. Oh. His okay. moves are so good. They are. Samus, however, survives forever. As soon as he drops down much lower, his... Oh. That'll do it. All and the Samus. All right, Davox moves on. <laughs> Ooh, Dombey and right. Musket. Fox Ditto, or are we going to see the Peach again? I guess we'll see, hey. Mm, we saw the Peach come out against... Uh, Halo, yes. Sea Money, or Flamingo, Man, or Boy, oh, it's or a Skeleton. Yeah, all, all the various things that he's <laughs> known by. The many tags, the man with many names. His matching outfit tilts me because the top is navy blue, but the shorts are black. I'm like, if, you think, if you think that's not bad, matching, the shorts flamingos are facing the other direction to the oh, shirt. Oh no. Yes. Apparently they're matching, says Connor. The store. I'm done. And the socks are pink. I mean, I get, like, it's a pink flamingo, so it's like the... It's like, you get the, the accent, color. I get it. Yeah, flip the... Flip. All right. Are you going to hand warmer? Yeah. It, it is definitely Miles. It's <laughs> not really a question. 
Okay. This should be an interesting set. Um, I normally would have given this one pretty easily to Miles, but um, or maybe not super easily. But uh, Miles has been playing real well this weekend, from what I've seen. So if the Fox couldn't do it against Kalen, his Fox was doing it against Kalen. Uh, why'd the Peach come out then? I think maybe it was like for the last game. Yeah. So like the, the mix-up, like yeah. I could beat you with the Fox, but go with the Peach, I will definitely beat you. Mm. I just feel like you, know, you, you beat Kalen, it's like Miles' little brother, and then you get to play against him. He's definitely like the mini boss before the final boss, and then Miles is the final boss of Brunswick. Yeah. <laughs> Because they've been uh, friends for a hell of a long time. A very long time. I feel like it's like the... I mean, SA has like Musket is really close or seems to have been friends with Flow Rats. Like that's the, the vibe I get. Yeah, their, their relationship seems much more functional than Don B and Kalen's relationship. Functional is the correct word. <laughs> Dysfunctional is... Yeah, I definitely was described. kept up in the Airbnb two nights ago, just here in the distance. No, it's 70.30 at 3 in the morning. <laughs> oh, fucking hell. <laughs> <laughs> it's disgusting. Okay. Okay. Classic Legacy Green Fox. Very appropriate. The BB colours. He's like waited on the ledge and Musket was like, yeah, you can stay over there. I'm just going to get you when you get back. Um, Musket's Fox is sort of interesting. It's super functional. Like it's slick and it does like it works and it does it, but it feel it doesn't feel like extremely like fluid. You know what I mean? Or fluent? Mm -hmm. It's very much like someone who knows what to do, knows how to do it. They played a bunch of the character, but they're not like I am a fox main. Mm. I guess it's because he's not necessarily trying to be cool all the time. He's actually just trying to win. Yeah, and, like he came into Fox <laughs> later in he was life. Not, he was not born in it. Yeah. He missed the critical uh, swag development period. The bit where you just learn how to like triple shine, sticky walk, and then you just uh, never get anything better than seventh. I think Musket plays all the Smash games. I don't know, maybe there's something with like because he's got so many like he's it's very it just creates like a more functional way of looking at all the games because you have to keep yeah. across like the different ways the games work. You end up like instead of learning how to play all the Fox, you learn like the building blocks for the different games and how they work and why they're different. Oh, maybe Fiction can write a tweet about it. He'll tell us. Fiction is definitely going to write a tweet. He's definitely going to keep writing tweets. Yeah. Explain why Musket plays the way he does. Well, what? you see. He'll give him like a, a 10 minute interview and he can diagnose the per how the personality and play style interact. Finally, someone who deserves this game. <laughs> Miles has been on that dare edge guard lately. Why did he go away from it? That last one, like the last one was the one to do it. <laughs> Musket was doing good angles, there we making go. him work. But now nah, the mix-up is as soon as they go like a little bit closer, you just drop down and shine them. That's yeah. how you finish it. Because you're tricking them into like not taking. I mean, you take yeah, you take away the tech option. Ooh, that was like the shallowest Ooh, press up smart. ever. That was the same frame. That was the same frame. We saw Dom B kind of clean up all the musket stocks, kind of like when he got, when he got over 100%. It's like get a juicy hit, up edge. smash him or edge guard him. Yeah. Whereas Dom B was on 130 there and not dead. <laughs> he's got th he's got some pretty good movement. He knows how to play around people. Oh, this is Dom B's favorite stage. What are you doing, musket? This is Brunswick. I actually like this stage against. Well, the Dombey's gotten a lot better now, but he used to be very reliant on like double jumping to and using the top platform to escape stuff or like bait in a very so exploitable way. Yeah, so taking it and taking it away from him, like he used to, he kind of still try and use it a little bit. I think yeah. it's, it's less of an issue. Like we just saw him function fine on FD without any platforms at all to, to move around. Like, so. Oh, that's a oh, nice edge guard. That was clean. Let's go into your seat. Just barely made it back. <laughs> Up air! We're in top eight now. We can't be doing back airs on people back to the middle of the stage. <laughs> what? Ooh. Oh my! Oh my! 
That was sick. Don't recreate that in Taz and see if you can SCI that enough to get back on the stage. I'm a little bit concerned. <laughs> of course, that is yours. You're like, for the SCI. <laughs> that can't be real. All right, musket. Oh. 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 Yeah, got yeah. it. Definitely kicked in the head. A weak bear was actually perfect there, because I think strong bear Dombi would have just DI'd up and, and survived yeah. with spot to up B high. Yeah. Oh no, no DI on the up smash. Unfortunately, all the wrong, very much the wrong DI. Thank you, transformation. <laughs> That was the exact thing he needed. <laughs> Just turn around like 10 times <laughs> in that shot. He was like, oh. Deeply confused. <laughs> All right, Musket pulling ahead for like the first time in the set, I think. Or thereabouts. The snares are so scary. <laughs> you just played against Nick. How are you still doing that? That's like the worst possible thing to do against a Marv. <laughs> hey. Uh-oh. Okay. Trick shot. <laughs> Trick shot alert. Shout out to Sora. Oh, dear. He's probably shouting himself out as Cowboy Trick Shot in the audience. After that one. But that's a, an S fat. Oh man. At least the first box I saw do that was S fat. Like do it a lot at least. The drill or the up no, that that like second hit only up air falling on top of someone off yeah. the up throw. It's good. Is he dead? No. He actually he DI'd this time. Oh much um. shortened. Someone want to hit someone with a, like a decent move? <laughs> oh no! Oh no! We wanted a hit. Fox did a classic. We wanted a hit. Mission oh, that's the LCD sound system song. You wanted a hit. Good track. All right, back to Pokey. That like full hop over back air to get Don B off the stage is like a Don B classic that I've been hit. <laughs> he hits people with that so many times. It's funny seeing so him get hit by his own Trixies. <laughs> Which makes you feel happy down in here a little bit. Yeah, and also sad. <laughs> Definitely out here for the Vic. For everyone. It's like seeing a man get hit by his own Trix. It's like, you should know better. <laughs> Come on, my man. Every sword cuts both ways. <laughs> So profound. <laughs> Get Damn kicked, you. idiot. <laughs> 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 okay. Miles is really trying to keep him off. It's going the same way as the previous stadium game. Is it going to happen again where it'll be tied all the way down and then Zombie's just going to clutch it? Break for Musket's heart all over again? <laughs> Man, the 2-0 really does not tell the story of how this has gone so far. It's been real close. Game like one. Last, la, la, game one, not so much. But last game on Pokey was, uh, it was very much decided quite late. And even game one, like, there was a lot of back and forth. It just kind of, like, Zombie just was cleaner. It was cleaning yeah. Musket up. That was good. That was a good landing. Oh, you can't do that! <laughs> so angry. Be more functional. The, the back air on the edge of the yeah. platform. Like, just do the right thing. I guess you just get shined. Yeah, obviously. Like, the, you know. like the last three times. Just give up such a juicy opportunity. Because you can act, you can do the up air and, like, kind of so serve that same purpose. Basically the same thing. Just yeah. serve an up air. Oh, like across the whole platform. Yeah. Don 
somebody's too good to let you get away with that sub off the punish. Fox's jab oh. sounds so funny. <laughs> that up tilt was oh that forward tilt was not what he wanted. <laughs> Alright. A two stomp from Musket. The straight in the straight like horizontal angle is 99 times out of 100, completely stupid. Don't do it, and you will die. <laughs> Please, everyone, and all you Fox mains at home, and you Falco mains, don't go sideways. You will end up burying your head in the side of the stage for maybe a whole second, and we, at which point you will be kicked. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> Zombie kind of notorious for choking. Um, and just like losing that, that first stock in that fashion. I don't know if he could string a few hits together here. Yeah. He could, he could run away with a little bit of momentum. Uh, I feel like that's the one thing that's really changed about Miles over the last two years is that choking. Like, I feel, I feel like we still see it every now and then, but like. It's a bit like, he definitely just got like beaten and then lost the first dog in such a way that a lot of people would get knocked over and maybe he would have got knocked over in the past. But he's definitely like here 100% still trying to get at it. Yeah. Like he's still in it. I think, yeah, and like when he does choke, he still plays a much higher standard than he used to as well. Yeah, 100%. Yeah, oh no. Speaking oh, of choking. <laughs> okay. <laughs> His, that was good. He's holistically improved. Like his play's gotten better. His composure just yeah is generally definitely well, much much better than it may have been. Yeah. I remember the man who counterpicked Jamie with Mark. Oh jeez. A different man stands before me. Ooh, that, that was meant to be a double shine. I'm like, why would it? Oh no. Oh, no. Will he get him? Oh, oh dirty. I could have gone. That could have gone a couple ways. Musket's facial expression didn't change at all. He didn't, He's he, evil. You think he felt anything? No. <laughs> I don't think he ever. All right. He, oh, hey, he made whoa, a face. Hey, he, he does feel things. All right, I take it back. Occasionally surprised. <laughs> That's like the mischievous grin, like, too wholesome. I don't like it. I guess that's why I'm the evil Dom and you're the good wholesome Dom. <laughs> yeah, that's oh, to no. Paris. Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> Definitely took her a little while to learn your name. Like, Are we talking about evil Dom? Yeah. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> I like it. It's <laughs> <laughs> oh, the cheese! Oh, Musket knows about the cheese. He does. He's from Gil. This is one, he's one of the TOs. He knows about the big cheese. Oh, great power shield. I like oh. it. All right, straight in. Get kicked. If he loses this game, like, oh, the, the, the momentum shift might be a bit real. Ooh, most, and shield grabbable drills. And, oh. Both playing pretty safe. <laughs> Just jumping. Everyone they want to win, but they don't want to lose. Oh. oh, is he living? He's living. He scrapes it. He scrapes it. Wastes his oh, double jump. And straight up just dies. Okay. <laughs> Spending a double jump into it, floating now with a nair. My one was a bit up and down, but it definitely felt like... Okay. It was about whether or not Miles could sort of hold it together. Especially that last bit. game, it felt like... Like, Musket was kind of just throwing things at him and was kind of up to... Felt like it was up to like Don B to stay composed. It was like a bit of an execution test. Not execution test, but a test for Miles to say, mm -hmm. can you perform an X baseline? Because you need to. Mm -hmm. Especially if he's trying to, like, trying to move on. We're here, moving into winners' finals with Order, Sora, and SA Nick. This is definitely going to like the obviously the, the two picks for the tournament. Mm -hmm. Yeah, definitely. It felt like Musket's game plan was sort of to test Miles out. And Miles managed to pass this time, so maybe Musket needs to go and do that. Like, how can I <laughs> make yeah. it more testing, or I don't know, maybe follow up a little bit harder? 
Oh. Did they just kiss? He definitely gave on him one lips? on the cheek. Oh. Oh, no, no. Kiss on the lips! Hey, man. Finally. <laughs> on the lips! <laughs> this is what we all wanted. I definitely saw Kai reach over for the unmute button. <laughs> But all right, this is these two would not have played in a while, right? Yeah, like in a minute. And this, this is a, a rematch of winners. Nick was still was it in winners last yeah. year, right? Like it was it was grand finals of uh, SXC 2017. Oh yeah. Oh right, that was when that was when SNX all like, came back, right? Was that last year? That was that his yeah. first win in a while? Yeah, it was. It was yeah. right. Yeah. So yeah, it'd be a year since they played. Yeah, because he hasn't come to anything since then. Because well, Nick came to a few Melbourne tournaments, right? But he sort of yeah, he hasn't come to, yeah, maybe not this year. And like, but he used to. But and then Sora's moved to Melbourne. So now they, we can't, they now missed we, each other. Yeah, kind of. oh no. So yeah, that's why I pretty. I think that may, might have had something to do with why he stopped farming the comms. It's because he couldn't farm the comms. Mm. Goddamn Sora's here. Yeah. And he no longer it was like before. It was kind of like, oh, I pay for my flight by winning the yeah, tournament. Yeah, and you get to see your friends for a yeah. weekend. It's good yeah. as. Yeah. But no longer. Mm. Although, I mean, maybe if he wins this, he might be like, hmm, maybe I should come back. Oh. Get better at melee. Good practice. He was looking pretty hot against Don B. Like, like game two and three, Don B kind of found a little bit of momentum, but the FD counter pick put Nick back in charge. See if Sora can go one. Oh! Better. Sora's big time not a fan of this match. <laughs> Thinks Marth is a dumb character. <laughs> yeah. It's pretty tough. I've been hearing about it. Ooh, nice. Perfectly timed invincibility refresh there. <laughs> I think of beauty. It's just like nice, simple, fundamental, good stuff. People drop all the time. <laughs> Because he could have just done it straight away, but he like... Ooh! Is he? I mean, he's going to make him back on the stage, but... Oh. Oof. Up for a forward smash. It's pretty good. It's a legitimate combo. It's a legitimate strategy. Oh, that was nice. Oh! What? Oh! Custom! Oh, oh my god! Oh, misses his dash though. Even like Sora knew, like after the up throw, he shook his head. He knew it was too beautiful to exist. <laughs> it couldn't happen. Not on this timeline. I feel like he should have done maybe like a, a jab up smash or up smash or yeah. like, laser land up smash. Okay. After a combo doesn't work, it's really easy to say, man, he should have catched that one hit earlier. But yeah, for sure. Oh, and, uh, it's Van Gong. That's oh. been, I mean, where Vic, there weren't that many Vic people there. So we're, we're like super. It's not in our history. Yeah. <laughs> we're one. We're now mindshare. Yeah. Evil Vic culture just like only cares about Vic things or things where lots of Vic people go. We definitely think we're the center of the universe. <laughs> well, at least the, the, like the southern hemisphere of the universe. Yeah, Australia's super important. <laughs> Ooh, far out. Great away. That was pretty nice. That's the sort of stuff Sora's gonna be bringing to the table. And like it's though like again, it's been a long time since uh, him and Nick have played. Like so it would have been Gong and then um, like not really that much over the last few years, and Sora has just been getting better and better and better. Like this is Nick's game to play. He's on his home turf with his Extremely yeah. quiet home crowd. I'm sure they'll pick it up if he gets anywhere. Oh! Yeah, oh he no. Amazing DI. Like, how did Fox not die at 163% from it? No, he's dead. The, I think that was the weakest. The weakest back air. The yeah. weakest one. Bah. Listen to the feet running around, dash dancing about. All right, Nick's up B game. Thank you. Saw in the crew battle, yeah, even against in, against Don B, he had a pretty amazing tech after one of them. But he's been getting yeah. clipped by moves on the stage a little bit, like that back air or like getting it ending up a bit too high and getting hit by an air yeah. or something. Something that's actually quite difficult to tech. Yeah. 
Hasn't quite been on point with his recovery. Even neutral starting. Yeah, that's fair. It's FD. I guess. I think Nick called for it, so like, you see, Sora thought about playing Sheik. Hmm. He didn't get grabbed that many times, so I think he, he might be fine. Unless that's like that's the mix-up this time, is you like switch gears and go for the grads. Awful spot for Ma. That is not a good one. How did I grab this? <laughs> Nick's not happy about it either. Mm, can get flipped by the gun. Get up attack. Oh. Used to end that one early. Oh, that was a really. That was a good up yeah, air. That was. It was too slick for his own good. He was like, oh, wait, whoa, that was so oh, fast. No. What do I do now? Mm, I love that rising there. <laughs> Taking a second to compose himself, which is fair. It's not, this game match is not going well. Okay, that was a really nice grab. Oh my god! Oh. So fast! Oh. <laughs> so fast! Too fast! Forgetting to jump before he does the <laughs> that back air. Getting hit by Fox that much definitely doesn't feel good, and it doesn't sound good either. It's boom, boom, boom. Oh. It's something you can just do to my like that's the mix-up game is you can just absolutely get scared away from the ledge in such a way the fox just controls it. Here we go. Okay. He's cooking. Ooh. Amazing DI though. Yeah. It, like he's able to keep his recovery options still super open. Oh. Ooh. Hack stash? Oh my god! <laughs> so many down tilts. So good. The down tilt chasing is like so effective. Because it's so fast and it's so low. You miss one tech and you're done. Oh no, he. Sora. Oh, Nick! <laughs> Man, that's incredible. Like, drop your punish and then be ready to fast fall that shine to snap to the ledge. It's really impressive. Because that could have been game over if he'd slid off. So Think about, yeah. oh, I just dropped that. Okay. It's a big opportunity that he missed though. Grab. Oh. He was at low percent and now it looks like it's game. Oh. Woo. Called out. <laughs> what did Nick just say? We need a, an expert lip, lip reader out there. Wait, what Nick said? Oh, yeah. I'm not sure. I just heard Blug and he said some 64 in nonsense. No. Looked like Nick said, fuck, I need to play better. <laughs> well, <laughs> may, may not have been what he said, but it's a sentiment that rings true. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> Nevertheless. So I was kind of... What? That never works when I do that. Nick always grabs me. <laughs> Top players get to cheat. It's the rules. Yeah, it is actually the rules. Josh, like, Sora's so putting so much pressure on him, and he's moving so fast. That, like... And Nick's also got to respect Okay. Him. He needs to... Oh, oh okay. He gives it back, though. Where is it? Oh my! Oh, Nick! He scraped past that one. What? He got to ledge so fast. Did it like... Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, guy. <laughs> Just couldn't hold it. <laughs> it was... It was such a fast little... Yeah, pivot into wave dash back. And he put that fast bell to... Oh, so clean. Ooh. Okay. Again, like uh, that sort of forward smash would be like would spell death for most foxes in the room. But uh, Sora in particular, it generally like has had the presence of mind. Ooh, oh no! Yeah, it was Not key. that time, but 100% of the time he's had the the presence of mind to get the the eye that he ends up just like right up the top right corner and keeps all of his recovery options open. And he's not getting super edge guarded by Nick. Oh, Jesus. Oh. What? Got away with it. What? That was so sick. No double jump. Getting hit by an up air. It's scary. Ooh, the SDI. Not your turn yet, Josh. <laughs> oh, no. He oh. Went for it all. Okay. Nick's coming a little bit alive. This is what we wanted to see. Ooh. Ooh. 
shield oh, sound. Oh my god. It's, it's definitely powerful. <laughs> well, this is some... <laughs> Okay, what are they going to do? Why didn't you up smash? Bop smash! Definitely hit him with the bop. Where? Where? Up throw. Nope. It's almost too high. Oh, there right. we go. Invincible Fox back oh, here. Yeah. Very strong. Nick's got a lot more chances, but Sora absolutely has the capacity to just delete stocks. Yep. Mm, missed. Yes. I, I, I would have gone for that jab 100% of the time. It must have been so close to hitting. Oh. oh my god. Oh my. Oh my. Just to use his oh, jump right. there. Maybe trying to DI. Kicks on the board. Still dropping a game on FD. Gives a set a whole different complexion to where they're going next and like who can be like guaranteed what, so to speak. Yeah. Because like in Marth Fox, usually like FD is sort of like, well, here's where Marth wins. And then Dreamland's like, well. Although Nick is really good at using space normally against most players. It turns out Sora's pretty good at it as yeah, well. Yeah, so unfortunately <laughs> for Nick. Hmm. Sora does want to take away. Really? Someone is going to win quickly. <laughs> neutral starts are for nerds. And we're all nerds, so we all should neutral start. <laughs> yeah, well. What the hell was that Nair? Drug Fox would not approve of that, Sora. No co super committal Nairs onto platforms, please. Somewhere he's shaking his head. Yeah. Did has Sora told you about his Drug Fox lesson that he had? He, I think it was, it was like two hours, they got two minutes into one set. <laughs> but that was one of the big things that he told him, was that he does too many like middle approaches, like, and try, like just nares onto a platform like that. Okay. Gives up like well, the he just stage doesn't control. need to. Yeah. He just like goes in whole hog when he really doesn't need to. He doesn't use like that. That was a really good back air that kept Nick in the corner. Because if he kind of nares the platform, Nick would have gone out. Oh, the grab. Follow-ups. Caught him. Oh my! Oh my. That up ah! tilt. Oh. The up tilt to catch him under the platform. Oh man! Somebody clip that! Yeah, order up! <laughs> <laughs> Chef Sora. <laughs> Seven up a mark. He is cooking. <laughs> God damn it. I hate me. <laughs> I really don't think you do. I am unconvinced. <laughs> I reckon you love them dearly. <laughs> The prediction of a quick game is it's so far playing out. Sora looking real good. Ooh. Oh. Okay. Oh, he, he right. caught him holding down. He was not even. Oh, the shy guys. <laughs> the backwards tipper would have. Oh! Let's go, Nick. Let's go, Nick. It's a game all of a sudden. Like that massive combo that Sora had. It's like, oh, we're done here. But Nick has other ideas. I'm sad this set's only got at most two more games. It's really starting to heat up. Oh! That last second wait to catch him with the side B. Ah! <laughs> What's ah! What do they do? Oh, shy guys! Oh! Ah! Why? Why? <laughs> Who? <laughs> Under what circumstances? Okay, they're playing their games. Oh! The snakes around. Again. Okay, but he's up. He's got a lot of options from here. <laughs> oh! <laughs> that one whistled. That one whistled. Oh, oh my god. Oh, the pop off. Man. <laughs> so I was happy about that one. <laughs> oh, damn. That game was so good. That was a really good game. Man, hard act to follow. Loser semis. You better. You got, your kids better put in some work. He took his shoes off. Damn. <laughs> It's an epic gamer moment.
Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> they call it the Chaos big cheese really. for a reason. Yeah, because it's a food, <laughs> the food, the food smell. <laughs> Someone was telling me Sora I'm has gonna already apologize. brushed his teeth for like the whole weekend as well. Oh. <laughs> Isn't that filthy smash a lot? Oh, no Don't way. just out your boy like that. <laughs> Look, oh if he doesn't God. clean his teeth, he deserves to be outed. In fairness, we're all in the same B&D and none of us brought toothpaste. So oh, Zai, and I, Zai and I had to go get it on day one. Two, two. Mm, this could be a, a spicy one. Dombey likes to claim at least that he's comfortable against Sheik. Yeah, he would definitely tell you how sick his Sheik is. Yes. And but I don't think we're seeing a ditto today. Oh, cool. That would be bad. I do pretty so. I think Davox is like, he's really clean and that's his strength, but like his Sheik does Sheik things, so if you know what you're doing against Sheik, I think you can get some decent mileage. You can just like play the matchup. Yeah. There's not so much like you don't need to re uh, research him so much as if you're someone who's good against Sheik by default, you'll definitely just be able to like carry that through him. And, like his tech chase game is really strong, but you know it's like ZXV for example is hard to play against because his like needle and platform movement is incredible. There's, there's not. That one part of Davox's game yet is he's kind of he's only been playing for a couple of years. He's got that tech chase punish really down, but there's no other part of his game that you're like, oh, this is super scary. And like, yeah, you're used to playing around Sheik's grab anyway. It's kind of a conventional. That was a good, really good tech to, to get back on stage. Actually, that is something he's really good at. He camps and techs like a huge nerd, a tremendous nerd. He is a tremendous nerd. Look at those glasses. There's some good needles. He has really good posture as well. Big nerd. <laughs> hey man. We're all nerds here. Yeah, it's fine. <laughs> Ooh, called him out. Okay. He read the direction a little bit. It's really hard to tech chase. <laughs> it's really difficult. Mm. I can't do it. <laughs> oh no! Oh. That, the shield push mm. off. Mm. Actually, we saw Don B um, at the last Smash Bruise, the last time Melbourne, we screamed in Melbourne. He was lost to Sora's Sheik in Grand Finals. Okay. I think Davox's Sheik is a little bit scarier. Than it. It's a bit more of a Sheik, that's for sure. And it's, it's less of a cowboy. <laughs> but maybe, I mean, maybe Dombey will be more com uh, comfortable against a more standard player. I would think so, for sure. With the SoCal experience, like, that's true. He's played against a like, Captain Face role. And yeah, yeah. Maybe not beating them, but he's like leveling up against the character. There's work cut out for him in game one, though. Oh, this is bad. Davox is good at this. Ah! Ah! He definitely wants to get off the ride. He'll do anything. Well, he's off now. For now. He's at 86%, so a lot of things are going to lead to a bad He's definitely time. in the intermission. Oh, oh. Could have gone so badly. That was so fast. That was, it, it's a quick move. Okay. And it's really good to not let people like jump around near your shield and do like, weird tricksies. Just they like get close to your shield, just bop them. Just hit them, hit them with the the nair. Oh, hitting the beers. <laughs> the Calm the those nerves. The power of the session ale. <laughs> Miles is definitely channeling his inner Miles. Ready? Go. Actually, like, especially if you're feeling a little bit nervous or like you're not feeling quite so hot, 
shooting like, a bunch of lasers and running around. Really good way to start a game. Like, it just gets your hands moving again. Yeah. Something that you've done so many times. Like, oh yeah. Try and get like back into the flow. Yeah. Like. But then if you get grabbed, <laughs> suddenly you don't get to play the game for about 20 seconds. Oh no. Okay. That double jump is super scary. What the? What? Why are you running away? It's BM. <laughs> Misjudge the height. Oh, he did that okay. like thing where you do like a nair and it makes like or the backwards jump or something. It makes Sheik land on the platform when she. Like, Otherwise, we don't have. Yeah. Looks really funky. It's it's wild. ECB is a serious plop. business. He's plopping him. He's definitely getting plopped at the moment. Ah! Ah! Let the man play! <laughs> I thought it was two player. Huh? Hey. <laughs> I was like, finally. <laughs> that was a buff, man. Oh, no. <laughs> he was trying to hold on to that one. Whoa. Gotta go really fast when you do get your chance. <laughs> <laughs> My sense holding back. You gotta get as much game in while you can. <laughs> Before it's his turn. Neutral is definitely Fox's turn. <laughs> yeah, it's real <laughs> bad for Sheik. It's not good. It's like this boss. Especially when you're at low percent, it's the boss that has. It actually has one move. It just grabs at like certain intervals. <laughs> Damn, that was a disgusting stock from Dolby. It actually was pretty gross. It's like, you know what, I'm gonna make you feel what it feels like to not get to play the game. Oh, oh no. <laughs> we messed up! You blew it! Finally! <laughs> oh. No! Uh. Oh! He's been real good at those needles. <laughs> Was that him messing around with the shield, the platform? Did you uh, see that? It's like a little bit of bow wow wow. That was a raw grab. How's the weather up there? <laughs> Campbell was on large. How many of those do you reckon there were? <laughs> I reckon it was oh lots. God. Yeah. <laughs> Kai just... Okay. Last stock. This is like... Goes without saying, it's pretty important. Oh, muscle. Oh, yes, yeah. okay. Dude, the windmill is Fox's friend. It, it's definitely on Fox's side. Like, the whole stage is. But the windmill in particular has saved many a Fox. With the windmills, like, just recover up here, and they probably won't kill you, it's fine. The windmill definitely gives and takes away, but it's also taking kickbacks from Fox, 100%. <laughs> no, Dombi. Now it's... Hands like, go that way. The other one. Get out of here. Oh, the SDI into the... It's not fair. Excuse me? Stealing your combo. Getting a combo stolen feels bad. It's just like when Fox taking place shines you. And you're like, oh. Except I'm a Fox man, so when that happens, that feels good. I feel good about it. <laughs> no, thank you. Yes, I'll have none. Oh, slow that reaction. Was... I should do it. Oh, that was so much later than it had any reason to be. He was pushing that one. Okay. Oh no, he. Oh, oh. this is combo. Oh. Okay. Oh wow, that was a really good grab. It's super hard to catch out fair. He's been getting a bunch of those. Of oh, a Davos coming down. Yeah, you can't, hold a, you can't hold in on down throw at 100%. You get a down smash. You definitely get a... 
I'll smash his feet! This <laughs> is <laughs> <laughs> this stage, I just like when I see the shit someone He's on the platform. And they're like not like high? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's what I think, a raptor boost. <laughs> <laughs> yeah! <laughs> sure, why not? What happens if you're playing Mark? Do you still Raptor boost? Side so get called out. No, I just tip her again. As usual. I think like I really like trying to shine Sheik's recovery because she's in a spot where she has to kind of double jump towards the ledge or she's trying to do yeah. an upbeat mix up. Because it's scary though. I, I mean like she can fair. But, but that's a big call out. Yeah. And it's super. It's really Especially if they need to double jump, mm -hmm. they'd have to double jump first. At which point you're getting them. Ooh. Okay. Some Sheik players get lazy. Oh, this is so bad though. Dombey's had the lead like the whole game. Alright. But he drops it. Mom's got another chance of living. Guess the play. Ooh. Oh no! Oh, that angle was almost n next level. Like this is what this is why Don B took the set against Musket because in situations like that he got a juicy punish and he took it away. Whereas Davox just did it to him. He couldn't pull out the Don Bangle. Oh, no. <laughs> is that something you wear on your wrist? <laughs> well, yes. Okay. He's definitely in the vortex at the moment. The crouch can down so broken. It's really good. Like this charged up smash it doesn't matter. Just hold down ASTI. I don't know where. Needles. He used to watch some Red X vods. You can just like needle every recovery. It's ridiculous. That man's is insane. <laughs> and an insane man. I was Davox, I'd be like, I've been robbed right now. This stock should be over, that up smash should have tipped it. Um, mods. <laughs> Patch the game, please. That's sort of what we did. Definitely <laughs> rolled back. Yeah, we rolled the patch back. Yeah. We were like, nah, this one's not done yet, put it back in, and we rolled back. How would the things get rolled back and then never re- like, that's- Especially when they're not fundamentally broken. Not often. Like the version control on this game is pretty shit. <laughs> yeah, there's four versions. And some of them have got some wild things. They just left the, like all the versions just out in the world. <laughs> Did nothing to like <laughs> spread them to the four corners of the earth. Mm, down tilt. Love down tilt. So good against Sheik. Okay. Oops. <laughs> oh, getting off stage and having to up B is God good. Kick. Mm. He's definitely just gonna get needled. <laughs> mm, mistimed his wave dash out of shield and did a roll instead. <laughs> Oh, what? He's too smart for Gets his own out good. There. He could have just done a normal combo, but he like went and waited where Dombey was going to tech, even though he could have just followed up already. He's trying to get in his head. It's not fair. I don't want to play honest. Really. Like, you play Fox! Yeah, it's the most honest character. I'm gonna <laughs> hit that one. I'm going to give that one the hard doubt. Okay. Coming into the set, I definitely felt felt like it was Miles set to win and Davox set to like you know put up a good fight. But uh he's really turned on. Maybe Miles has been a bit shaky, but he's been pulling some stuff out. I'm a little bit scared for Dombey if he gets down to his last stop, like he's giving Davox just enough opening, like Dash dance with Sheik? This is not allowed. People don't do that. This character only gets to have one movement option, you hear me? Oh, that's actually, that's pretty rare to see someone 
Dash dancing. Like, kind of using it effectively. Oh, that side B was so scary. Sweet spot. I think Don B should have been on his last stock a long time ago. The extremely dark red percentage sign agrees. Okay. <laughs> a bit, a bit just slow. Grabs. A bit slow. Got him. All right, game five. Miles picking it up. Davok still he kept up that whole game. Mm. It's kind of the opposite of the previous game, like. Miles Davok's jiggling himself into concentration. Davok's got a couple of openings and he couldn't convert it. And Don B got that last one. His dash attack. <laughs> Definitely takes those every single day of the week. Mm, Holding down is good. Ooh, that was the... Doing the mix-ups! He got out. Yeah, that was some actually some pretty good ambiguous DI and then doing a few different tech options. And he hasn't really missed many techs so far this set, so that was that was definitely time to throw it in. Surprise him. Oh. <laughs> the jump back on stage is real risky. It's very easy to just get completely slapped. Slapped in onto your next person. Oh no. I've seen Foxes die after getting like Ed or John down smash, so I reckon 60%. You just kind of take that. The oh, tech! Oh, oh my shine. god! And that'll do it. What is this? The fa like a purple masked uh, comic what book character? This? Sydney? The Phantom? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. That's also the Phantom. Did you ever have. When I was a kid, I had those weird, like, I had the Phantom comics. I had a bunch of old ones that my dad had from many moons ago. Yeah, I don't know where they came from. Like, neither of my parents really were into it. Probably dad's, actually. Yeah. <laughs> that was definitely the, the, the style of the time. Weird, like, Ooh, it's so ramen. lame, though. It's so weird and, like, all... <laughs> it's definitely a pretty cursor. Yeah. It's definitely some, like, early one artifacts. Right, no wonder, like, comics weren't big before, like... Marvel and DC. Wow, these they were really lame. were just for nerds. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, they're still staying a pace. No one's running away with it. And this whole set like, has just been like bit by bit. Oh. Oh. That was commanding. That was Miles saying, I've had enough. Definitely, he's trying to be the big brother taking the wheel. Oh, oh he missed his. He's starting to really, like. You kind of feel both of the. Like, there's a little bit of nerves going there's on. There's a bit of desperation. A little weird options. Okay. Okay. Maybe that's part of why this set's close, is neither player's really, really nailed their punishes. There's been a lot of openings, but a lot of just like, oh. oh my All God, right. Last stock. <laughs> Down the last play. man. <laughs> Who's getting fourth? <laughs> oh, oh, no. no. <laughs> oh, this is clutch. He's in the vortex. <laughs> Can he escape? <laughs> clutch. Can he DI a hype? Oh. <laughs> Where are the mixes? Oh, he, oh, he gets out. 48%. I don't know if he's surviving another one of those. He's like super, oh. pretty much out of crouch cams with percent now as well. So, I mean, he's, 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 his options are slowly disappearing. She can absolutely... Oh, oh. The classic! That first empty the jump. The boot will do it. Miles walking directly towards the bar. <laughs> it's a place to be after... Oh, right down to the wire. And okay. Man. I definitely thought that was going to be a 3-0, or 3-1 for Miles. He was going to move on and then get spanked by SA Nick, but here we are.
that, that even though that, that last chain the, or the down throw tech chase got him up to four, like nearly 50 percent and then yeah. he was sort of able to clip him with a reasonably meaty aerial and all of a sudden he wasn't in crouch cancel range and he had him in the corner zombie's like oh i got a shield because i can't crouch cancel what, what can you do and then what do i do and then he just jumped and get kicked get slapped yeah. really strong play by Davos. Like, did enough in all those situations. Gave Miles a chance to give him in the opening, and then he, he obliged. Let's see how much of that he can carry into this set. Nick is a very, very different player. In no small part due to the different character, I suppose. <laughs> but they're also just a very uh, different approaches to the game. No neutral starts here. <laughs> oh, my. Oh! Oh my! He's definitely trying to just run circles around him, and he's being moderately successful doing so. Yeah, it's funny. Like he's just been in a matchup that Fox very much dictates, and now sort of this one's a little bit more. He has much more agency against yes. Mark. It's definitely a little bit of anyone's game, as opposed to. Uh, Fox is in the driver's seat. Two, two, Whoa. Two, two, two. Okay. How that up B not reach? Maybe he curled it too much. The up B curling is very strange. It's mysterious. <laughs> it's like such a weird little tidbit. I think if you it is. a casual player, you would like never even notice I that it's in the game. I definitely played Math for six months before I realized it was even a thing. This is a long time ago now. So I think I bet you if you did a survey of like everyone in the venue, there'd probably be like a, a decent proportion of people who are like, what? Curling Marth's upbeat? Yeah. Like, angle up beat for Marth? What? You can. Yeah. Not much, but it's there. Enough to either not get tippet or definitely get tippet. That was so fast. Look at him. He's holding his own heel. Those needles at low percent that he's been doing, uh, he was doing it all like all like maybe 50% of the stuff against Miles, like charging while he's dead, and then just finding the opportunity to blast him in. Like at the start. He caught him. Too close! But those needles, just to get someone closer to getting out of crouch cancel, I feel like it's probably like not just building percent, but it means that very early he can like do his best to eliminate that option. Mm. And Mars Crash is a big part of his toolkit as well. Because yeah. he gets a decent amount of grab in this matchup. So he definitely it, does. CC grab. And his grab range is so big. He's definitely got long arms. He's definitely got some order sore yes. arms. And he's so tall. <laughs> he's so, so long. We should start a basketball team. <laughs> I don't know if he's got an athletic bone in his body, but damn, he's long. Who cares? He's long. <laughs> <laughs> I guess, right? And the fall, like the little crouched oh. animation that Sheik does after her up B gets avoids the up tilt. What is this? <laughs> A game with 3D hitboxes? Crazy. Hit bubbles. Yeah, the, like, some of that weird ZX action stuff that can go on as well. <laughs> that was a bit of a call out. That was a really, really bad spot. <laughs> <laughs> Truly, that sucked. <laughs> like, taking right next to the ledge, but not quite on the ledge. So he's never going to slide off. He takes in, there's a Marth waiting for him. He takes in, blades against the his table. arm, his hands are warm, they're ready. Mm. There's a chic shaped hole where the grab is. Fades back out of the grab and runs in. Keeps him in the corner. He's just, he's just keeping him there. Yeah. It looks scary. He's trying to get on the platforms, he's throwing needles. He made a mistake! Ooh. Not, he's such a robot, he doesn't make okay. mistakes. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> I hope you watch this pod, Nick. <laughs> he's right there! <laughs> uh, that forward smash looks unintentional. How did he get sent like that one? Like 45 degrees to the left from like a up tilt that should have sent him to the right. Yeah, up tilt's a magical, magical thing. 
No one truly knows the inner workings. Except maybe, I guess, Frog Fox. <laughs> Aw. Man. This Marth has nine lives. Carry. Man, he might not. Uh, please grab the ledge. God damn it. She just messed it up like. Just that one. Like before. Please grab it. That needle into shield drop fair. So fast. That that fade through was real good. Oh, so clean. Oh, Dash dance grabbed his cheek. That's not right. <laughs> Nick was being sick. a little bit too hungry at that double fair. <laughs> Just an approaching double fair is not great. Okay. I don't know how these guys usually go, but I feel like I would guess that their sets are not this competitive. Mm, we need some local knowledge. We need to log on to like Oz Smash. I don't think they've even really played much in Adelaide, if I'm being honest. Okay. They don't play. Definitely unexplored territory. Getting some new data. Mm. Devox has been uni oh. for a couple of years. He might be back more permanently soon, so they might get a chance to play more often. But yeah, if their sets are like this, man, like, I'd want to see them play. <laughs> for sure. But does that mean oh. Nick will stop coming if he can't farm the tournaments? <laughs> can't, it just stops playing entirely if he can't farm anywhere. Starts flying to Sydney? Maybe Brisbane? Oh, uh, yeah, like some of the Queensland guys. Like, they're pretty uh, matey. They would definitely get slapped by the Nick. Oh. Alright. He's off. No jump, but... Man, that crouch cancel was so good. What was that up air? He has no jump as well. Oh my god. Oh my god, the tips. What? The, that was the behind the legs. Ah! Oh, Someone clipped that oh. and then re How did that miss? It was the legs. The same thing happened to the Falco on Yoshi's. And it makes me want to just absolutely lose it. If Falco is standing on the platform on Yoshi's and Marth is holding the ledge and he does the attack from the ledge, it hits almost every character, but it doesn't hit Falco because the way he's standing and the way his legs are spread, it literally goes like behind him slash through his legs. Like this where the sword goes is over. It, it went like behind between Sheik's legs. That's incredible. It would have hit on flat zone. <laughs> oh, because there's no Z axis. Be, yes, on because flat the, zone. the hitbox, the hit bubbles get squeezed. There's like there's only two uh, planes. Yes. What a video game. Oh, flat zone oh. Went. Right. double jumped into a uh, deletion. I I feel like maybe those platforms were helping him out a lot because he seems to. Yeah, Devox is. He's actually shown some pretty slick platform movement. He has. Both against Don B and against Nick so far. We'll see if he gets a turn, or how far he gets with it. Okay. Oh. Yes! That's exactly the sort of stuff he needs to be showing. Hey, so Nick's got a pretty strong neutral, so he's, need, he's gonna need to take every chance he can get. Ooh. Great babysit. Oh, I have to get back! The secret booster, please. <laughs> so, you know, most cheeks, most cheeks have shortens, but he's got boosts. He's <laughs> oh. about to get around Marth. You just can't be scared if he's you just can't, you cannot hold in on forward throw. Unfortunately, there's <laughs> extremely strong mix up games there. Oh, I think he double jump. jumped. I think he jumped. Looks like it. Ooh, gets to the ledge. Devox really looks like he's missing the platforms, like, for real, like, it's... I'm not sure what you can do against Nick without platforms or Sheik, but... I have to 
heard a lot of Sheik play, so like, this stage is kind of the most even in the matchup, but I can see that for sure. Neither did them get any uh, platform shenanigans. And, like, Sheik's follow ups on Nath are actually really strong on FD. I can see that. But again, like, Davox is. I mean, he's been playing for a couple years now, like, a, two years. Okay, that, that was a really good hold out to not get immediately slapped. So I think he gets to play against the Marth of Nick's caliber that often, so he may not quite have the game plan for FD. He's living. Oh, that was a he's, ridiculous That was so upbeat. good. Of course, down air, what other move? Unreasonable, like he should have died, <laughs> and now he gets a kill. <laughs> Just, I disagree. I <laughs> like, that hurts. Like, any momentum that Davox sort of is building up, getting Nick off the stage. Like, <laughs> no. Nick's recoveries have been really, really good on this stage, especially with no platforms to escape to. It's pretty crucial. Back throw? Down throw? No, that was a back throw, wasn't it? Rare form. Oh, oh. got him! That kind of makes up for that previous stop. Oh, man! Forever. That, that, the forward air when he was on the ground to grab was very, very delicious. He is hunting. Oh, he's so keen for that hit. He really doesn't want to lose this game. Okay. Tiny little pop up. <laughs> Some pretty big pop ups from the crowd. <laughs> Two home cr hometown boys, so I guess they're a bit like, oh, who do we cheer for? Probably a bunch of Victorians in the crowd cheering for whoever's behind. <laughs> yeah. The classic. Oh man. Oh. <laughs> Ooh. Full through up it. Dead. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh. Get chased. <laughs> oh man. I he was going to up air, but that'll do. So far, this set has been pretty good at denying that down and out. I'm not sure if he just lost the mix up game there or if he just he wasn't in it in the moment. But that's what happens. Ooh. Is he going with the custom? Yeah, that was, who knows? Oh, the tag! Those, those and the so strong. The ledge. Broken. Especially his mouth. It's so hard to like not respond with a committal option at the ledge like that. And then if they get the tag, you just get grabbed. Okay, okay, the tech, but that's, that's that timing. You, you, you hold, you wait, just after the poof, you press left. Oh, that was the double jump curl that pulled him out of that one. Oh, Ooh, wow, he's got that was good. That was. <laughs> Weird trade. The classic, like it's such a thing now that he got the he got the hold out that time. Because every other time, like before this game, pretty much it's been theirs. Yeah. Oh. oh no, Nick. <laughs> Nick knew that was definitely that was a missing purpose. Okay. Oh, the, the little side B poke. Just making sure he's awake. 
Back throw. All right. Tournament stock for Davox. Definitely a... He's coming out swinging, which is what you like to see. Good slide off. Ah, grab him, Davox. Make you play your game. Oh! Almost killed oh, him. Oh, okay. He put himself in a real bad spot there. Now we've got a match. Like, Thank you. Next. <laughs> Battle do it. Nick gets his run back <laughs> against Sora. We're gonna have a quick break. So hope you guys like ads. <laughs> you should have subscribed. Hope you guys like supporting your community yeah. creators. Shout out to Kai. You don't even get ad-free viewing anymore with subs. It's oh. all with Twitch Prime at least. Is, is, yeah, I'm pretty sure it's only Twitch Prime subs. It's very upsetting. It's that is very upsetting. upsetting. But oh well. Um, yeah, we're going to be going into a quick break uh, just to freshen up before these grand finals, but stay tuned everyone. Time for grand finals at the Big Cheese. I hope Sora's got his shoes on so that's the only cheesy thing that's going on is the tournament itself as opposed <laughs> to the smell of his feet. He's got his shoes on for now, but who knows? Yeah. He's playing against Nick. Yeah, maybe the shoes on, that'll be the difference. Nick's got his run back from winner's finals. Where uh, Sora took it 3-1. And last year, yes. SXC was grand finals. That was two. definitely a, a momentous Nick victory. Mm. Re-announced himself as a... Whoa! Here we go. Nick's just run through. Like, ooh! Reasonably comfortable in losers' finals against Davox. Davox gave it, took a game, made Nick work, but Nick was able to stay in front the whole set and most of the game. So sort of keep up the pace. Mm. Only moderate discomfort. I don't know what Sora's been doing to stay warm. If he's even been staying warm. I think he's been in the crowd. Uh, I think the word is whoring. All that tech. What was Nick trying to counter there? Who knows? Ooh, that soft bear was so nice. Oh, Spud would hit that. 
Don't let him hear you. <laughs> oh! Oh! That is definitely the captain going down with his ship. It had, <laughs> had one chance. Not too bad to trade stocks there as well. Like, kind of that was the worst exactly. outcome. Exactly. Yeah. Oh, it's that like was sick. He pushed him off and made him tumble. Like, at best, he took the stock clean. At worst, they traded. And he was at 130 or something crazy like that. Yeah. So. You get what you can take of that uh, percentage. Ooh, a bit of spice there. Ooh, a meaty one. Sora definitely just removed his shoes, slash limiters. <laughs> Gross. Yeah, the big cheese is back. <laughs> He's definitely pulled out the big cheese. That jump over the forward air is so deadly. It's such a kick to the gut as well. Oh, jumped over a down okay. tail that time. That's, that also hurts. Did he jump? He must yeah. have jumped just before he got tipped. Oh, no. N T S C. That is, that is what you need to be doing to beat Sora. And you really gotta kill him every chance you get. Think of chances. Grab by the ledge into 13%. That's not how that works. Whoa. Marth kills you when he grabs you there. He does. Down through and down tilt. <laughs> oh, misses the tip. Does not miss that tip. Game one to Nick. Okay. And Marth taking game one against Clocks changes the. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, okay, buddy. <laughs> just breaking it nice down on the character select screen. I'm definitely waiting for the clap. Ooh, stadium. Yeah, maybe if we go to FD this time, the DK will come out for set one. <laughs> <laughs> You could have seen Dom's amazing clap. It's a good one. Okay, that was an option. Oh, I wow. Cut. The fade, the magnet, the myth, the man, the legend. Oh, Nick! Shaking his head. He meant so to know that Nick. SDI. And he has no jump now as well, is so. The dash dance around the bear. They're both, both of their spacing is so good at the moment. Oh, what Mitch? Oh, oh. The timing. Oh. Oh. He, he, was he was ready and waiting. Ooh, <laughs> what? That's supposed to be unbeatable. Waits for the spot dodge. I think the line for the up smash that. That was a spawn boy now. Alright. Even stocks on maybe the single most whack transformation. Super whack. He's in the pit. Oh. He's saying, come on, I'm ready to rumble. Brother. This transformation definitely benefits Fox more than it benefits Marth. It does overall, 100%. But the pokesies you can get on the right hand side. Like you can do that. You, you can, can poke the through the stage. Mm. If you run yeah, into that little uh, cranny and dump, bop. Yeah. And Mark can do that weird, like, up B into like, down air edge cancel thing. That thing is well. not actually that good. It's real flashy. But you can, like, you will get kicked for it. Oh, crap. Sora is trying to murder this man. Be a little and he did. <laughs> he killed him. Another one drops down oh. from the ship, though. He's got him. He's trying to put the fear, in God, fear of God in him, and I think he's succeeding. Ooh, trying to call out a jump. Pretty committal for him. The 
Was that a dare? dare again? Yeah, I think so. I think, I'm not sure if it was a, a survivable dare, but I feel like it was a dare. Oh, it was pretty high. He could have, he had his double jump still. He could have yeah. jumped again and like done it. Yeah, I, I, I was mean, like, no. <laughs> for sure. That? Oh, oh this, that was, that was very good. The, the uh, shorty. Ooh. Nick's just like, kind of panicking <laughs> when he's up, with his up B. Like, it's not quite precise enough. Oh. Pulled out. <laughs> Who was that? <laughs> Definitely a Victorian. <laughs> yes, oh, Josh! He's playing on his shield, he's waiting for a mistake. Oh, how that did was that miss? Frames, frames. Nick with the up tech chase. Sora was saying he was trying to work on um Am's attacking those, so we'll see if he can do it. Like that, like that's the that's the next level of that option when they're coming when you know Nick's coming with the up on the tech chase. Oh, oh Sora does, he hits him with a couple meaty ones. He's holding on to the stage. The second hit only, but Nick scrapes the blast zone. Ooh. Oh! Okay. What's Nick's answer? Why did you grab? That was definitely a bob smash. Nice. That'll do it. <laughs> a little pop off. Back on the board. Both of these boys settling in for a 10 game grand final. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, well, Don't drink too much water, sort of. Yeah, he, well, he might have to pee in between. You can have a quick toilet <laughs> break. He definitely sets. just offered some to Nick. He said no, he had some more to himself. He's definitely a man for the community. If you're in need, he's there. Mm. Even if it's only to make fun of you. <laughs> Twitch.tv slash Sora underscore SSPN. Is that right? Is that his? I believe so. Yes. I can Wanna. Nick does not scream. He's not esports enough for that. He's not a wholesome enough individual. Oh. <laughs> well, Nick's not wholesome. Nick's uh, lots of other things, but wholesome is not one of <laughs> Nick's qualities. <laughs> <laughs> He's definitely here to win at melee and make incredible facial faces while doing so. <laughs> I wasn't gonna say it. <laughs> oh, it's it's not kicks. You. Okay. He's got the game on his side at this point. Let's see what he can do. He's playing the game, game on his Sora's side. Sora's building the wall against him. That's what Marth's meant to do. Sora's so good. How does he flip in the script? He's not human. That was the tip I felt around the world. The power shield. Good at power shielding. It's definitely the big brain. Ooh. Z power shielding is definitely that thing a bunch of people learned. What was it two years ago? Did it for two weeks and then mostly stopped. Very much like a Z canceling. V. What oh, V canceling. V canceling. canceling. That, that thing that affects the meta. Marth SDIing out of Fox of Shine and not like making the grab follow up miss. So strong. Oh. Ooh, up, early up B works out for him that time. Able to clip him. What? Can't let him back on like that. Its reactions are normally so on point. There we go. Oh, All right, can he, he no. can't get. He, he got him out, but he couldn't get him to stay out. There's the end stay out. It's like when you have an inside dog and you try to put them out. And then they <laughs> no, just come back in straight away. <laughs> like, no, no, stay no. out! <laughs> Waveland back so good! So I was like, I'm an on stage fox. He's definitely an on stage fox. He's actually not I live though. Here. Man goes off stage with no fear. <laughs> <laughs> I think you might have a little bit of fear now. That was... Yeah, after getting okay. comboed like okay. that, he's like, maybe I should be an off-stage fox. I don't like being on this stage very much. <laughs> Get thrown around. Abused. Oh dear. 
Okay. He's built up his hand. Can he close it? Oh, yes! He can! can. <laughs> Absolutely. Textbook. God damn. He really did do it. Everyone clap along at home. Absolutely don't. Just do it. Just piss yourself off. Why not? <laughs> it's like sit you in your room, just clapping along. That's the most Fox player stuff thing I've ever heard. Just playing with yourself. Like, just, well, I'm, I'm, no, but okay. <laughs> Never mind. Just practicing tech skills. Being weird at home. <laughs> just being like being angry about like making yourself angry, always being angry about things like, oh, this isn't fair. Yeah. I play the best character. I'm, I should win for free. Fox is hard. Well, yeah. So is melee. <laughs> This is so effective. He's yes! <laughs> Hits him with a juicy one. I can't believe Nick came back that last game. Like, why are we playing on Dreamland? So I had a three stock to one lead. That's huge. <laughs> and then, but then he came and took the first stock here, and like, he's winning. How is he? I can't just be like, oh. Oops. Oh it's man. over now. It is. Someone's getting murdered. He's not gonna. He doesn't get there in time. He's just playing the platforms. And he knew exactly when Nick wanted to come in and like. Oh. What? That was that was a big call out. That was a you're gonna be right here right now and you're gonna die for it. Reached out his long arms and his long fingers and like stuck them in Nick's brain. Just like absorbed information. That is an unpleasant image. <laughs> no, thank you, sir. <laughs> Good day. <laughs> that is some body horror. <laughs> Speaking of body horror, someone's getting kicked. Woo! Turn around. Nick slice just slips in a little slice. All that he needed. So it's like it goes to the other side. It's like, the only thing missing from that run to the other side of the stage was a taunt. <laughs> Get him off the ledge. <laughs> Shout out to Skeletom, who's one of the foremost pur purvey uh, purveyors of the... Ooh, or proponents of the run to the other side of the stage and taunt when someone's camping the ledge. <laughs> So it's it's an honest strat. It works every time as well. <laughs> Say, what about your mate? Show me them. Bop <laughs> smash! <laughs> Get him to check the weather. See if I'm there are any clouds coming over <laughs> over the horizon. Damn it! I don't know. The hexagon's pretty good. Okay. Ooh, I thought it was too far away for a grab. Oh, it... Ooh, okay. Game five. Ten Let's games go. incoming. Maybe, maybe. Mission complete. Where do you reckon we're going? He won on Battlefield, so he's already used his FD. Yeah. Wait, and he, he won on Stadium. Oh, okay, fun. Yeah. <laughs> it's like arguing over who gets which side of the stage. Like, if you ever play with Spud, he only goes to the right hand side of the stage. That's so. When you're invulnerable, he like always you respawn. He's always on the right. Huh. Interesting. Both of them wanted to be on the left here. Nick relented. Ooh, okay. Sora calling him out, saying you're gonna have to recover better than that if you're trying to play another set. 
that was a tank. strong impact from there that went absolutely nowhere. What a oh, bleh, 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 bleh. What? Th that was absolutely the play. That was that was correct. But too soon. Yeah. No, like at that percentage, at that place, in this at this time of day, this time of year, in this country, <laughs> that was correct. In this building. In that chair. In this locality. <laughs> On that TV. At the Big Cheese, 2018. Oh, kill him! Oh, what? That so drop. smart, that was, that was actually very smart, despite the smart meme. It was genius. It was actually incredible. Like he went to the exact spot where he could still get on the stage. He went down to the absolute goddamn pixel he needed. Applied the bump smash. All right. Sora is up one. He is two tiny little princes away. Oh my! But Nick's saying no, man. I want to keep playing. It can't end here. Not in my town. Oh, going for a ride here. That's a lot of slices in not very long. Town of nightmares. <laughs> Definitely a nightmare. <laughs> nightmare. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, Josh has been just like all weekend going up to people, just like yelling nightmare at them. <laughs> nightmare, nightmare, nightmare. <laughs> He's trying to play the grab game. He's just running in with his foot, saying nightmare. <laughs> okay. Oh, the equalizer. We're down to it. Oh! Doesn't miss the A 30! Oh! He sneaks past! He whistles past the forward smash. He's dead! Is he? He's, oh! He could have just oh, down right. him anyway. Like, Grid for another one! <laughs> Why did he F smash? Down air kills there as well. Apparently, forward smash does, yeah. friends. Guess it's easier. No one gets to go to the toilet for a little bit longer. <laughs> I'm starting to really need to pee as well now. It's a commentary <laughs> classic. It is. Because you talk a lot, so you're like, oh, I need to drink water. And then you're <laughs> like, oh no, I drank water! <laughs> Too hydrated. Right. Back to... Okay. Every set pretty much should just start on Battlefield. Anyone who disagrees is wasting my time. I don't like stage striking anymore. Let's that is go the Battlefield. Fox man privilege I've heard in my entire it's life. It's like Fox's worst stage! I'd, yeah, I don't... God damn, I do not give a single goddamn. <laughs> mm, okay. It's good to see neither of them really being phased so far. They seem to still both be real in it. Yeah, both these guys have been here before. They've been they have reset or reset someone. We all have we all have our days to reset or be reset on. Oh, let's go. It's good to see set two. I feel like generally, like Marth can be a little bit of a war of attrition. Like playing against Marth, like uh, like set two, a uh, reset is generally a place where Marth's gonna like start shining through a little bit more. Maybe the Fox player is starting to tire. But um, they're both definitely coming out with the big hitters. Neither of them are showing any signs of slowing down. Other times we get the, uh, the opposite. The player who was in winners can start a bit slow in the, the first set. They just sort of use the first set to warm up, make sure they're like prime, gather some information, try out a couple of things, gather data, download. Ooh, gets him to jump. Nick is so good with his back airs in just like weird little math situations where most people are just like, but I don't have a hitbox to put there. Nick always lands the tip of back air. My nose. Stupid hay fever. Thanks, Adelaide. <laughs> Ooh, going for a really smart back throw. I think Nick is probably going to DI off the platform. He wouldn't give it what? Oh my. It's a trade with an F smash. That's actually, that was, that was nutty. Break. So smart. That's a Joey. It's been a while. It has been a while. 
understand how Nick ever gets hit sometimes. He's so slippery. He's a slippery little man. Oh my. He's so good at this. Ooh. Let's see if he's got another one. Oh. What? That's insane. The madman. Give it forward air like that. Ooh. That's not right. He's chasing him. He's got him. Slide off. Oh, oh he's trapped. He's shaking. He's in the vortex. Can he get back on stage? He's really high. He's still got a lot of... All right, he lands. He catches a lateral. Oh. And so he drops game one again. <laughs> the Dom B reassurance. You've got it, man. <laughs> Do what I could not. <laughs> Is that like homie, home? I don't know. It's cute though. It's not. It's. What water is this? It's yours. <laughs> <laughs> that was definitely an evil, uh, the evil Dom smile. <laughs> yes, yeah, mine. Okay. He escapes early. Sora is keeping up the pressure. Oh, what's he cooking? Oh man. Both starting off with big combos, but no one has to stop. Is that a double jump? I think I saw it. Oh, I didn't! Sora! Oh, oh he barely. Oh. <laughs> Maybe that was what Don B was telling him. He was like, do the Don Bangle. Donathan Bangle. <laughs> this is like Kurt Angle's brother. Donathan. <laughs> wrestling champion. Donathan Bangle. <laughs> They're definitely estranged. Ooh. So many down tilts. It's good. So good. It breaks crowd counts with the tip. <laughs> Nick's really good at using it too. I've been a big fan of forward throwing Marth at the ledge this set. And do you feel like he's getting a lot out of it? Well, I mean, he did it twice there and didn't kill him, so I don't know. <laughs> Could have gotten follow ups off up, up throw. Yeah. At least knocked him back off. That's about all he had from there. Let's see what he does. Great side B, as low as it could be. That is how low he can go. <laughs> Sora's too tall for Limbo. Ooh, whoa. That, I don't know. Insane SD. I've been surprised by this well. man too many times. He's pretty Who knows what he's capable of? Leaf? Maybe. Maybe that's the word I'm looking for. <laughs> He escapes top platform, but Sora's having absolutely none of it and chases him up there. Oh, he, he does that all the it. time. And he spooks him into the back throw. Sora, absolutely not a fan of that, even remotely. No respect for it. I want to play the game. Let me back air you. 60 40. <laughs> 9-10. That coverage, the, the Nair missing, but he's he's there with the dash attack. Oh, oh man. These people are so inhuman at this game. <laughs> he's just sitting in shield like, what do I do? Oh, yeah, he, there's always that moment you're sitting in shield, you're like, the game is solved, and he's got it. <laughs> Impossible. Woo! He's stacking up the damage. Juicy percent. Oh, this is his stage to win on, but he's really and doing he it. dies oh. here, though. Oh. 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 JB? Yeah. Oh! <laughs> it's like, did you see the anticipation yeah, of the play? Yeah, that was like, come on. Yes. That was definitely an up smash from the gods. I feel like it might not have happened if like Nick wasn't airborne. Like he got hit with like the tip mm. of the strong hitbox. He held in. Like mm. those things aligned. And I think that's what, like Link. Are we gonna see anything? Oh no! 
Donkey Kong. I want to see. I want to see a Donkey Kong. No, no, that's a good move. Running at him. Oh, Nick Stay. Tate. Okay, oh, that's not one he wants to drop. This is uh, Nick Stage for that exact reason. The pivot grab, the pivot, the grabs, the How movement. Did How did Nick avoid that? Oh, slippery. He runs in a diagonal fashion. Oh, there we go. Okay. Grab time and uh. Oh, the tech! Whoa. Oh, and he shines him back onto the stage as well. That's the last thing he you reacted, do. but I feel like maybe he wasn't 100% ready for it. Yeah, that was. I think that, that was a suspect. Very suspect. What are they going to do? He gets out! Justice. Some would have you believe. <laughs> Scary. Nightmare. <laughs> nightmare, nightmare. Yeah, that's what Nick was standing over him. Nightmare, nightmare, nightmare. And I was like, no, no, no. That's He's waiting on the ground. Is a nightmare. <laughs> <laughs> yes. That neutral B was so smart. Like the like the presence of mind to say like, I have spooked him into the side B. Definitely transcendental. Wait, Nick showing that he is worthy of obtaining the big cheese. The humongous halloumi. <laughs> I like that one. I reckon it's good. I thought I came up with humongous halloumi, thought it was the best until I heard large fromage. Oh, that one rhymes. Damn. All right. Mm, spicy FD combo. This is Nick's stage to win on, but it's one that Sora could take. Campbell likes to call the chef to you know. <laughs> And someone's cooking. In winners finals, oh. it was Sora, but now Nick's like, this is looking grim. Order up. Okay. He just calls it. Oh, Sora looks so good in winners finals as well. This <laughs> Points to the He's like, no, uh, no thank you. I know how this one ends. No words. Oh, not him. Ooh, Ooh. SDI though. Oh. Oh, he great gets tech. him. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> Taking turns to the ledge. And that'll, that'll look. Ready for the up smash there, but a little mix up. Nick's DI had been like a teensy oh, bit. Shit. Nick's coverage. Oh, it was very good, but he snuck through. The slope. <laughs> Boss quite I think he might have also gone a little bit too far. It's like crazy how the slope like changes. Mass hitboxes yeah. change. Exactly, like the, the down tilt to poke recoveries, the ledges, I mean, like the, the edge of the platform. But then, like, sometimes you miss recoveries that you would hit if the slope wasn't there. Yeah. Well. Just like, what? Okay. He's got him off again. He shines a shy guy. Ooh. A thorough boot. Around back he jumps over. Does he get the... He gets him. He trades. He's burning. It's a bit of an ambitious edge guard. Oh! Ooh. Sora just calling him out, saying you have to be at least this tall to ride, to ride the next duck. Oh, great crouch. Gets just inside the tip of range. <laughs> oh! Oh! oh All right. Game five, or is Nick going to pull some kind of ridiculous comeback out? He's done it before. 
certainly has. And this would be this this one is of the how it starts. It. No tipper though. We didn't hear the doom on that one. Oh, good angle. Ooh, side B's. Oh. Okay. Extremely high percent fox. What's he gonna do? All right, and he's, now we have an extremely dead fox. Stupid angled stage. All right, this is so close to just being Nyx, like it's Sora's stage, but like, again, can I grab at the ledge, a down throw here, a pop there. Could go either way, 100 Oh, what are they doing? The, the footsies! Oh, jeez. Oh. Oh. oh, nightmare. Oh, great SDI. Okay, and... Oh, he scrapes. He's just living by the absolute thread. Oh, got him. All right. Last game of the tournament. Great flow chart edge guard there. That's so clutch. Like, so, <laughs> like I'm shaking and he just <laughs> calmly stands up. We're both up. over here being a little bit Shine. the whole time. Fought again. We got game 10. You were right. I was. You called it. Oh, he's oh, oh he did my. it. Oh, oh, my. That is not good. These are the ones he needs to hit. Game 10 of Grand Finals. That'll be in, like, the GR Smash will make it <laughs> a special for, like, at the Discovery Channel, it's like top 10, I shouldn't be alive. <laughs> but, oh my! The survival! Punch, punch, oh, punch, punch, punch. That was so late. That kill was so, like, barely made it. Ooh. You scared him. Oh, the SDI again! Nick is just a, he's a bit of a robot of the SDI. Oh, so he, he missed the eye. He's get him. And what did he do? Oh! Oh my god. No room. Slide. Hits him with the strong one. Oh. Remorseless. Oh. Both these guys, they're both out here just slamming each other. Oh. oh. I don't think I've ever seen Sora make such intense facial expressions. <laughs> He's rivaling him in and out of game. Oh! oh just let him rip! The cleanest! <laughs> They're poking. Oh, he got no jump. He scared he him into jumping. Dead. He should be. Yeah, he is. Okay. <laughs> Alright. Both only got two men left in the tournament. Who's taking home the big dairy? The lies from Ash. <laughs> <laughs> I think he might be able to get back to the stage, but Nick's okay. all over it. He's one stop closer to the sizable Bree. Big Bree. He's not letting him breathe in the corner. He walls him in back into the middle of the stage. He chases it. it. He knows what's going on. He knows where Ooh. he's going. Oh my. What well, can he. Oh, oh, he went for it all! He wanted it all, man! Line. Last stock, game 10, grand finals, the big cheese! Will this be an order up? Oh! oh that, was possible. that was the lowest! Doing the limbo! That was an unheard of height! Fox is like, how is he getting back? How is he getting yeah. back? He lived! He's got Santa! He's on. He's oh, on don't one, run at him 159! The highest down tilt! Oh! Shadow Realm! Nick takes it! Oh, that's pop off! Oh my! SA Nick is the Big Cheese champion! It's extremely intense. Game 10, two sets. He takes it over the real, like, the favorite Sora to win. Oh man, that was a. They, was, they slugged that one out. That was a marathon. That was so. Oh.
Those back that, and forth the whole way. And that last set, I feel like, if you looked over every like Australian set over the last year, none of them had such a high ratio of hit stun to neutral game. <laughs> that was just like one opening, and they, they, whoever got it was just carrying it, carrying it, carrying it. Oh, man. I don't have words. <sighs> Alex? All right, I guess. You're right. closer to the... I, <laughs> get I guess. Yeah. All right, I'll go get them. All right, I'll go get... Oh, no, I have to talk to Nick. Oh, he's going to be insufferable. <laughs> Nick is a... Win, wins the tournament. <laughs> ah, Nick's insufferable. He can be. I can't believe this. Can't you, Nick, sometimes? Baby. <laughs> there we go. See, straight away. <laughs> We're back. Damn, like dude. I never left, dude. <laughs> that was one of the best grand finals in Australian history. Yeah, do you, like, like honestly, should we just do the standard so PCG sick. Nick interview and you just talk? Like, let me know if you want me to ask you want me to ask oh, you a question. Please. The I floor mean, is yours. I don't know what to say. That I, my heart's racing. I know Soros is too. It was a crazy set. I'm really glad we were able to put on like both play well, honestly. Yeah, it was si ten Some games. Some crazy recovery shenanigans happened. Yeah, what Soros is crazy. How'd you win? He's so good. <sighs> I don't know, dude. I don't know. <laughs> I guess I'm pretty, you know, South Australia. You gotta hold it down. Mm -hmm. Home turf. He defended home turf. <sighs> I feel very good about that. <laughs> yeah, I saw that pop off. The kid, uh, <laughs> see the emotion in it. The thing is, last yeah, last year I also popped off, but this was like way less of a cheesy kind of. Mm. Whoa. Do you want to just interview me, Sora? Yeah, you guys want to talk? Can they hear me? Yeah. Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> that was sick Dude, it was so fun, dude Oh, the uh, ah, It was just hype moments for everyone, dude Dude, I'm so <laughs> glad we both Sorry, played last, last set we played last year here It was like cheesy as Yeah, yeah This set this is just like, like solid, nice. man I'm glad you practiced for this, for real Dude, yeah. up throw dunk from center I was like, I <laughs> Yeah, I was like, cool <laughs> Yeah, exactly <laughs> nah, There was just a lot of situations Where it was just like, um I now have the confidence to go for overshoots. I'm getting clipped by the Nairs, but like the fact that I'm going for it is just like, you know. You really caught on to my attempt to, attem attempts to like overshoot kind of slow fold Nairs. I was getting away with them a lot. I need to use those undershoot drills more. I just stopped using them because I was like, how are these working? I, when I swear I rewatch the votes, I think I'll understand. Because I use them, I'm like, but I don't understand why these work, you know? Yeah. Like, I wish I could just, no, damn. Because it's in the tense moment, you obviously know, right? It's just like, you're not trying to, I'm trying to well, learn, obviously. the thing obviously, is, like, when you're laughing, you're trying to, like, grab it, you're trying to grab it, and you're trying to dash down, and so this, like, wall of drills. Yeah, yeah, it's, it's really so hard to get through, yeah. But you can just start detilting, I think. Just safely detilting that is really, yeah. <laughs> oh. yeah. You know what? Like, honestly, that was, that really brought oh, Melee back. <laughs> yeah, dude. That, that please pick up hype. Super Smash Brothers Melee. I'm, Please. I'm happy for Australian, you know. Dude, that was just sick regardless. I'm so glad we've had a set that was like... I think either like way, no matter who won, no one would have been fucking salty. And yeah, I think exactly. that's the sick part. I, there's no salt. I'm just so happy that we had a good set regardless. Like, obviously you want to win, but it's just like, yeah. fuck yeah, dude. Dude, just like, because it's like, playing against like regular people, they don't like give you the... Like I said this before, they don't give you like the opportunity to just like do the sick shit. When you miss that SD, I was just like, now we got a game. Dude, I thought I could get the sickest combo on you. Yeah. I was like trying to side beat Donkey. Dude. Doesn't have a custy bone in his body, <laughs> boys. <laughs> I thought the that would robot. be the sickest way to finish it. Dude, and our winner set, I got a fucked combo on Yoshi's. Yo, like dude, that, dude, zero to death. Yeah, clean. I was just like, holy shit. Dude, I, I think I just gotta like, I don't think about those. It's just like, what links into what? And then it's just like instinct a lot yep. of the time. I think thinking about it during the set is detrimental. Dude, I couldn't, there were so many times, like, it, I wanna rewatch the set with you. It's just, oh, just, I, nah, and then it's there like, a lot of times. Bags. There are a lot of times in the set. I'll, I'll, I agree no, with no, you. No, no, no. It's <laughs> just like, no, obviously, you fucking outplayed me. No, like, no. You just get called no, me. I agree. I'm just saying, like, it's just I so frustrating. <laughs> Yeah, it's just like, yeah, man, like, oh, you should have won. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, I agree, yeah. <laughs> no, I think, I think, honestly, that was about as good as we could have hoped for. Oh, that was so sick. And at the end, too, I'm just like, <laughs> yeah. I was like, I was like trying to overshoot. I got some overshoots, but I couldn't convert them, and that was huge. Because I was just like weak nares. I'm like, yeah, I, you actually are way more adventurous with your edge guards and friendlies. But you did get punished a couple of times when you no, did no, no, go it's, for it's, adventurous it's, edge it's, guards. It's the threat tournament. of the adventurous edge guards, you know? I like, like that. That's, that's, that's why it's just like, you know how you do those early uppies now? Yeah. It's because they're there. And it's oh, just you like, actually got me so many times with that. Yeah, it's because like I've shown that I can do it, you know? So it just sh it's like a new mix up. It's cool. But it's just like. I definitely, in like our, our winner set, went the lowest shine ever, like the blast zone. Oh, yeah. So I, 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 in friendlies, it's just like testing the waters and shit because it's friendlies, but it's just like I still take a little bit of that into our games. Damn, it's just like as well, like you just weren't dropping a lot of your punishes on FD. Finally, yeah. thank God. Yeah, my punishes were I hate, really good. I hate I winning on FD and it's just like... <sighs> I literally, like, I, like, I literally think it's lit, like it's Uncle Punch. <laughs> yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> I like picked the Uncle Punch and I was like, 
comboing the fox and it was getting out all the time and I was like, oh, my combo's unreal. <laughs> now I know. <laughs> yeah. That's yeah. time. Wait, nah. So did you right, we practice? We wrap it up? We, we done. Yeah, I practiced. Yeah, you practiced on Uncle Punch? I, I, practiced, on, I practiced with Muscat okay. with Lemon. Close, nice. shout Closing to thoughts lemon. from Kaiser wants us to draw. Uh, and shout outs. Dude, thank you to legit just like everyone watching because Melee is so sick. Oh, it's so sick, so dude. Cute. Shout out to the, uh, I love this game so much. It's so sick. <laughs> oh, my goodness. You're planning to check out Ultimate. Can I yeah, I'm probably going to drop it. I, I'm like, yes, yes, it's Melee-esque. It's just like, no. What do you think about this tournament overall? <laughs> I thought it was fantastic. I yeah, I mean, you won. <laughs> I, no, like, honestly, <laughs> I was just having fun the whole time. I was just no, really legit. getting into just, playing Melee playing with the invaders. Oh, dude, I'm so sad. Can you come back, legit? Yeah, I mean, I'm kind of back. I don't know. Yes, I'm trying. World defeat. I learned how to crash cancel and how to SDI some things. Oh, so. it's so uh, obnoxious when it's just like you get the back air and it's just like I think the mix up because I saw uh, you mash it like you don't actually time it a lot of the I time. Mash it. Yeah, mash so it. it's just like I, I think I should in like implement. Sorry, we're, we're getting sidetracked. Um, yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. We should wrap up anyway. Yeah. Shout out to, to everyone. Shout out number one to and thanks to Order again here by the way for making this a lot of fun to play friendlies. Yeah, this is so sick. No, thank you to Order for taking me here. Do appreciate it. Big love. Sorry about the jersey. I swear we fucking got ripped in the wash. <laughs> what did you do? How did you wash it? I washed it like three times because I didn't go to launch mat to dry it. And then it just got sh shredded. Anyway, thank Whoa. you so much. Uh, gamers will one. rise. Don't tell, let anyone tell you otherwise. Gamers thank will you. actually rise again. Shout outs to Kai. Shout outs to Flow Rats. <laughs> the whole <laughs> SA scene. Shout outs to the Smash 4 scene as well. Everyone who contributed. Oh, hello. hello. All the staff. People behind the bar. Shout outs to... Uh, yeah. Everyone who came, everyone who watched, you guys make this possible. You make the reason we do it. Oh, what a time. Shout out to Nick. Shout out to PCG for commentating. <laughs> shout out to Nick for commentating like four hours of doubles. Yeah, damn. <laughs> shout out to Dom, all the commentators. It's just big love. It's amazing. You don't often so get friendly. a tournament like this where everyone's like on a euphoric rush at the end of it. You know what I mean? Yeah. Uh, you, like, oftentimes it's like, you know, someone wins and it's, it's like a landslide. <laughs> I, w I wouldn't. I like straight up would not have been sold if I Yeah, no, that was like, a sick set. Like the reason I went for stuff like that, that stupid but very would have been cool if it w worked. Like side B dunk <laughs> is because I was like having fun. Yeah. yeah, yeah, no, and that like you could tell both of you were having fun. You're playing like you were playing loose, and it was that was part of why it was so exciting. I think Kai wants to yeah, pack up. I think <laughs> Kai's, Kai's done a good job watching, this guys. weekend. So <laughs> goodbye, everyone. See you next time. Huh? Well, no, I was just like trying to get him into for some like sw easy retweets. Like that was it. Yeah. Yeah, just is the stream done? Uh basically I'm just going to sign off. Okay. Uh put my name in. Okay. All right. Thank you everyone so much for tuning in to the Big Cheese South Australia's like I guess new generation homegrown major. Um Actually, you know, I'll get Flowey on the mic for a little bit because he's the main one for, like, all the organizing stuff. So I'm going to get on the mic real quick. Yo, Jack, Flowey, sit down, man. Have a seat. Have a seat, buddy. You deserve it. There you go. Okay. So that was a fucking event. It, it sure was. So for Bye. everyone in chat who doesn't know, this is the man yeah. who kind of put in the bulk of the yeah, work I for this whole weekend. Well, I said I was last year after SXE. I was fucking mad at how shit ran then. <laughs> and it was just yeah, like, she's just going to go for it. I was just like, you know what? I'll fucking run it. Good stuff. Thank and you so it, much for putting I'm it on, I'm shocked man. it went so well. Like, yeah, yeah. It went Down really to everything. Well. It went so well. Oh, those finals were... I was like counting the f game fives. I was like, that's a lot of game fives. And then that mm. shit happened. That was such a good grand oh finals, too. Oh, my God. Um, but, yeah. I, uh, it was It was so... Actually, like, I feel like this was just like... A long time coming for SA yeah, to have like exactly. an event like this where everything's just like, just chill. Yeah. Just chill. We got beers and ciders flowing. And like we have a really good like top eight going. And it's like all the little problems like, oh, melee starts, double start now. Like everyone was like, eh, yeah. we'll finish early. It doesn't, it doesn't matter. matter. Well, we did. Yeah, we, we did finished finish early. early. So. so, yeah, it's been really chill for that shit. Yeah, I've been on like, 
I've been on the the behind the stream desk for most of the weekend. You might have seen me play on stream a little bit. Yeah. Dom Hines, the man on the mic earlier, also helped out with some clutch equipment that helped yeah. us really get like two really yeah, good two streams going streams. for the weekend for like Smash Four and Melee. Yeah. So those are the big thi like the big clutches of the weekend. Yeah. Ruben on the bar stuff. As yeah, well, yeah. Like all the bar came stuff that came in clutch. as well. We oh man. So much fucking beer. I, yeah. <laughs> I, I don't know where to post the like number. <laughs> After I calculate it tomorrow, <laughs> <laughs> of how many beers we ended up drinking. We'll, we'll, we'll see what it, happens. It was a lot. But yeah, it was um, a lot. If you would like to support the channel, please, at the bare minimum, hit us with a follow. Follow at SA Smash Central on Twitter. That's where we post all of the South Australian yeah. events and, and right. you know, results, VODs, what, everything. If you're in South Australia and you're not part of the community and you want to pick up Smash, that's the place to do it. Go to also the SA Smash Facebook group. Uh, facebook.com slash groups slash SA Smash and get involved and get involved like with events like this that w I hope we're going to be doing one of these like every year now yeah I can't imagine us not doing yeah. one like this next year particularly with Ultimate coming out mm. like and if you really want to support the stream as well hit that subscribe button get a couple cool emotes for you on the way out um, thank you all for watching so much thank you all for watching the big cheese Hell we're yeah. going to have an even bigger cheese next year hopefully Oof. you know the larger fromage <laughs> Even larger fromage. The the grand, what was it? Oh, I can't remember what. Yeah, I, I anyway. was definitely considering, like making a, you know the, is it CEO that does the death pool where everyone that yeah, just signs yeah, up yeah. like anyone that makes a cheese pun goes in the death pool. <laughs> <laughs> just, just sign them all up. Nah, it's like oh, not not today, buddy. All right. Well, yeah. I think with that we better start packing up. Yeah. Thank you again for everyone for watching. Thank you, Jack, for putting on a stellar show. No worries. Thanks let's to everyone who showed up. Oh, let's Wouldn't have been the same event without everyone here. Let's all get like, fucking drunk. Yeah, let's go to the after fighting, man. Yeah. Let's sign up. All Hell right. Yeah. Follow me on Twitter at KP Kaiser. Yeah. Follow Flow Rats. Flow underscore Rats. Yeah. Let's let's do it, man. All right. Peace out, everybody. See you stream.